Just be clear enough. Believe your story. I no, never I said I didn't believe John. it. I just said I wouldn't no. only believe her. No, it's it's John that I need to have a word with because uh -oh. I saw a clip on LSF that was like, Ooh. oh, from last night. Ooh. She, she oh, true. I remember. Uh, you yeah. accused her of trying to clout snipe Slick that she was just mad that he was getting a lot of viewers. I remember That's that. Not if you're going on Dr. K, like, uh, I gotta ask you, like, why? They were so adamant. Like, they were both talking to me. And they were like, yeah, like, the last part of the call is really important. Like, we have to leave. And I, th I thought at the end it was going to be like, this is where, like, Miss Kevin Meyer are going down. Why is she entering the call? Whoa, she what? says she wants to make it. She What's needs to reveal something about you. No! What do you want? Why so hostile? Well, I don't know. She asked to come in here. Now she's not saying anything. Adri, you got to turn your mic on. Yeah, you think? Oh, I know what she's going to talk about. Uh oh. Uh, oh, no. Is it that she's in Texas or she's afraid? I. It makes sense. Hi. Hi. Adri. What's up, guys? Uh, not uh, much. We're What's worried up? about you, actually. I'm not. Oh. I'm okay. Yeah. I'm safe. Cool. Yeah, yeah. Cause That's what you think. I just realized, Adri, if that guy didn't get banned, we would see him at TwitchCon. <laughs> yeah, you might still see him there. You don't know that. <laughs> Be careful. Are you, are you going to TwitchCon? <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're both going. Uh, maybe. Wait, uh, Steven, how are you getting in? Why the fuck would I go in? With, through the dog door. Yeah. <laughs> the dog door. Good one. Hey, made her laugh. Look at that. Um, I wanted to hop in the call yesterday. But, but Adri, we, we are like meme lords. That's why, you know, if it's anything serious, you better warn us. You know? uh, I can have plenty of serious conversations, okay? Okay, go have a serious conversation about sexual assault right now as you're mm -hmm. memeing. You're so tough. I'm good. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I wouldn't do that out of consideration for Adri, okay? Not because I'm not comfortable, though. <laughs> Adri, um, anyway, Adri, yeah, now that he's made the call incredibly f awkward, what's up? Yeah, Adri, um, let me make it a little more awkward. <laughs> uh, how you do it? No, but Adri, uh, I didn't watch your stream. Did you stream since? Like, have you, uh, how's the backlash been going? Is there anyone oh, attacking you? I streamed. I played Fortnite with Action Man on okay. yesterday. I like Fortnite. Um, and it was fine. My mods working overtime just because, mm. you know, there's a lot of backlash, but it's whatever. Um, what's up? What do you want to chat about, Adri? Oh, I just want to say hi and, um, yeah. Oh. Just drop in and say hi. Oh, were you and listening, clear up Adrian? anything that needed to be cleared up, just in case. Is there anything yeah, that needed Destiny to be cleared up? Yeah, doesn't believe your story. I no, never I, said I didn't believe John, it. I just said I wouldn't no. only believe her. <laughs> no, I, it's... It's John that I need to have a word with because uh -oh. I saw a clip on LSF that was like, Ooh. Oh, from last night? Ooh. She, she, oh, true. I remember. Uh -huh. You oh, accused yeah. her of trying to clout snipe Slick that she was just mad that he was getting a lot of viewers. I remember That's that. Not true. That's what exactly what he said. Holy shit. Yeah, if it was and, true, I would have done it on my screen. Oh, my God. Yeah, so go ahead, Adrian. Beat the shit out of him. I was, I was going to talk about it on Dr. K today, but. Um, oh, I have to watch that. Work. How did that go? No, it didn't, it didn't <laughs> work. You have to watch. Wait. You're shameless. No, Twitch fuck. was down. Twitch was down. So. Twitch was down today? What? Yeah, so we tried and it just didn't go Wait, up. Wait, what does that mean, down? I don't like, know. Like, not up. What do you mean? <laughs> wow, that's not ever. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean? What does it mean it's just down? What the fuck kind of. Does saying... that ever happen? Yeah, I think it's happened before. But I was like, oh, okay. Um, so I just, I got all ready for nothing, but it's okay. They're running out of money to keep the servers Wait, on, dude. Streamer cuts going are going down to 40%. <laughs> pretty soon. Literally. If you're going on Dr. K, like, uh, I got to ask you, like, why? Um, Just to, like, kind of bring back the fact that I'm, like, a human being. I feel like but the isn't, there li isn't there anyone better for that? It's Dr. K. Who could be better than Dr. K? He's invited. an actual doctor. I was invited, and I was like, okay, I'll, I'll do it. Is he a doctor? Yeah. Oh. A Harvard doctor, he says. Hmm. I don't know if there's controversy, but let me move on. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I was um, upset because... Let me just clarify this. 
I was upset because I was told originally that he's going to be taking a long break from streaming and he's going to get therapy and make sure he doesn't do this to any other girl Wait, in who? the future. Slick. Slick. Jesus, oh, keep up. Claw, no, I'm thinking of Claw, Slicker, and so many streamers. Ms. Slick is beyond I'm, therapy, okay? That guy can't so, get help. But, no, but or, so I'm sorry, I meant Claw is. Fuck, go ahead. I, I was under the Don't impression that he was... Don't say that, Steven. Don't say that. Okay, I did. I was under the impression that he was getting therapy and taking a break from social media, and then literally a couple weeks later, he went to New York and stream sniped Andrea Botez, or Alex Botez, those test sisters, mm -hmm. and then... He streamed like his little comeback stream, and his comeback stream was all people being hearts and chat like, "We support you. We're so sorry Whoa. this happened to you. Um, I'm so, so." And it just made me feel like, damn, it just like nobody really cares, and it just made me feel like de like humanizing. Oh, you like, mean a year ago, Adri? Sorry, sorry. Yes, yes, yes. Like okay. the, I'm referring to the situation that you said. Okay, like, okay. I, I, wasn't I, I thought he's live right now. I thought he's I wasn't with the upset. Pesto. I wasn't upset because he quote, got more viewers, I was upset because it seemed like people- He got away with it, right? Yeah, he got away with it, it's just like a slap in the face. Yeah, that's how I worded it, actually. So wow. Good. You're, stop, don't use that word. We don't use that word here. Are you still- What was the word? Stop, <laughs> please, stop! Nothing, none of those words. We don't use those words here. Um. Wow, thanks for sharing. So, I, what made you guys become friends again? Where it's just we're a matter of friends. how much shit I'm willing to put up with from fucking people that we're not try friends, to farm the dude. fuck out of my personal life. Are, do you guys really believe streamers are capable of being friends with? Each I'm other? friends with people. Yeah, it's called being who? a human, John. Yeah, who? Adri. She's my close friend. Oh my! Adri has talked so much shit about you. Yeah, guys. I bet she has. No, I have. You not. absolutely have. I've words gotten back to me. By the way, motherfucker. I have not talked shit about you. If anything. Uh huh. Um, yeah, there now here come the qualifiers. To, no, people are trying to farm me to talk shit about you because I was talking to that one guy. That one oh, guy. Oh, yeah. Inkle. Yeah. Wait, Adri. That was the worst day of my life, by the way, Adri. Thank <laughs> I you. know. I was begging and Adri was... for sex for hours, and she's like, no, I've got to go see my actual <laughs> Chad boyfriend, fucking Hinkle. And I, I dropped her off crying the entire time. It was like one of the most humiliating moments of my life. <laughs> oh, my God. No, he was sitting there saying, like, dude. Did you see Destiny? He was so, like, he was, like, scared of me. And I'm like, bro, no, he wasn't. He just said, like, he doesn't fuck with you. He I didn't want to, okay, this is what I don't like. I don't like it when people act like they hate each other online, and then when they see each other in real life, That's they're like, oh, saying. yeah. So when he saw That's me in real life, he was saying. like, oh, yeah, like, shake my hand. I was like, no, I'm not going to shake your hand, motherfucker. He was like, being, yeah. like, yeah, it's fake, being, like, fake. It's so fake. Yeah, it's so fake. Yeah, and then he got, like, and super insulted. And you were being real because you were like, bro, uh, like, I don't fuck with you. Yeah, whatever. But <laughs> I'm going to backtrack a little bit, guys. Yeah, backtrack. I genuinely genuinely do not find it fake if i have uh, an, a beef with someone but i see them at a party and then i don't make the party awkward and be like hey i don't like you like i'll just shake someone's no hand. it's one thing because for me if i have beef with someone at a party i just don't talk to them like i'm not gonna go up to them and be like hi you what if they the came party? up and, and said what if they came up to shake your hand in front of everyone you're gonna you're gonna embarrass them like, no i guess i would act civil but it's, yeah, I, I would cave. You have I'm to make that. You have party. to settle it then. Like I've seen people at parties and stuff. This happened with politics people last TwitchCon, where I'll see people and I'll be like, okay, well, like if you want to chat, we can chat. But I just, I, it makes me feel insane. You don't be like their bestie, you know what I mean? Yeah, it makes me feel insane when I'm like fighting with someone online and then they're all chill in real life, and it makes me feel like, okay, well, is everything online fake? Because I'm not like a fake person. Then, whoa, then whoa, I feel like whoa, an idiot. Whoa. I feel like a dumb. No, 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 no. Hold no, on. No, John's only mad because you John. You guys are crazy. That means no. if I ran into Stephen at a, if I ran into Stephen at KFC. He would John not is take only my mad hand? because he purposefully picks fights online all the time, and he's so different. They're not me. real. It's the no. internet. Wait, John who, is what's such a sweetheart hold teddy on, bear on. in real life, and then don't, online? Don't ruin my image, Adri. I don't. I will turn on you right now. Okay. <laughs> don't, don't, don't. <laughs> then online, he's like hating on everybody all the time. Yeah. No. If Adri, it's like, if not... it's like, where? Sorry, go ahead. Finish it. No, go, go. I, I was gonna say, like, if it's like some petty dumb shit online, then like it's whatever. Like oh, then, Steven, then if I see like then. I like I don't I don't think I hate you. The milking my personal life is a little bit, but I don't like. No, you but, Steven, but if you but if, but if hold on, wait. I feel awkward. Wait, 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 wait. Because look, no, no, no. Wait, look, let look. me just finish one second. All right, if somebody yeah, is yeah. like going in on you, like personally, like hardcore tagging online, like saying, "Oh, this guy's like a, a dumb fuck, fake news, blah blah blah," and it's like some hardcore personal political shit or whatever, and then I see you in real life, and you're like, "Oh, bro, what's up?" It's like, no, that feels like so fucking fake. I hate that shit. But that, that's not fair because mm -hmm. if I ran into you at a uh, restaurant. 
in Florida. Yeah. That means because of the Anna stuff, you wouldn't even look me in the eye. You just walk away. Um, so yeah, maybe. To, uh, How is that unfair? We been, because we've been through that. everything together. What yeah, but if fuck? we're like fucking enemies, I'm not going to see you in real life and be like, oh, what up, John? Like, oh, it's so cool, okay. bro. Yeah, like, that's so, so yeah, cringe. So like, now you're going to call it the word enemy? Yeah, that's what like, we were. Dude, we're you've... enemies. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my. Yeah. Enemies. That, so, so what about Nick Fuentes? Did, did you punch him in the face? No, because we were on good terms. We weren't enemies. Oh, damn. Well, you got my ass. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. I mean, yeah. I mean, there's always a middle ground. I feel like there's, you can be civil with someone at a party if they come up to you. Or... No, no, no. What I'm talking about is one major issue with Steven, not an ongoing Vosh versus Steven war. That would be weird if you guys shook know, hands. Lord. But if well, no, but like me and Hinkle had like ongoing like online fighting yeah, and shit. Like it was, it was like, not just like a one thing. Hinkle, I, for Hinkle, for Hinkle. And he was sitting there. This was him. This was him. He goes, "Hey, you want to go up and get a drink? Like we have free <laughs> drinks on the rooftop." And then you were like, "No, nah, I'm good." And he goes, "Are you sure, man? Are you sure, man?" And you're like, and "No, on, like I really what, don't fuck with you. I'm sorry." But what is the appropriate adult thing to do? Just ignore Steven? No, we just no, say hi and then we just walk away. It's, it's, yeah, see you later. Yeah, it wasn't like well, a big on. deal. He can't, he can't say come for a drink. No, why would I go? No, we're, I don't. I hate this dude and he doesn't like me. <laughs> or at least he pretends not like me. He doesn't like me. Why the fuck would I go for a drink? That's so weird. Yeah, it's just weird, it's awkward not, you, small talk. Like, oh, how long have you been living in LA? Oh, There's no oh. way a streamer is saying this. You'll stay on a six hour call with someone you hate having drinks. Come on. No, <laughs> bullshit, dude. I'll tell anybody. What, no, fuck you. You might do that shit, but I don't do that shit. If I don't like somebody, I'll tell them I don't like them or I don't hang out with them. Like, it's what that simple. You, you, bro, yeah. you would stay on a four hour call with uh, Vosh, even if you didn't like him. Come yeah, on. fighting, but we're not going to be like fake as fuck. Like, oh, oh, so Vosh, it's just a monetary blah, blah, blah. thing, right? No, it's not it's a monetary thing. I just like real interactions with people. If somebody wants to act like they hate me oh. like online, they need to bring the same energy in real life. I don't want somebody to act like... That's no, like no, some catty weird shit. We make fun of women for doing that. How are we going to do the same shit in real life, John? What the fuck? Yeah. Be because it's, it's, it's not... No, no, wait. If you, if every internet beef is that serious to you, you're a schizo. No, because I then know I am talk schizo. shit about me behind my back constantly, and then they see me at parties, and they just stare at me. And it's like, bruh. No, I'm no. Not gonna it, I'm not going to go up to them and be like, oh, oh my God, I love your outfit. Well, I don't think Hinkle did that. No, I'm, I'm not saying Yeah, I, I think he said, come up for a drink, which is usually what people say. <laughs> like, what the fuck? It, it sounds like one, one party is more mad than the other to me. I'm not even... I'm well, not yeah, because it sounds like he wasn't mad about anything at all. He just wanted to cloud farm. <laughs> but you weren't yeah, even yeah. live. What the fuck? Well, I know. That's the whole point of building those connections, right? Okay, I come from a world uh -huh. where I work security. If someone had beef with me, they'd come to my doorstep and punch me in the teeth. Anyone I argued with, they'd come next week at the club and they'd be like, hey, man, can I come in? And I'd be like, yeah, come on in. Like, that's the real world, man. Come on. You okay. guys are... It's not Dragon Ball. <laughs> it is Dragon Ball. But Sorry, yeah, that was, um, that was clearing that up. I think the difference is because I, I don't know why people love bringing Adrian, that up. Over a man and over is talking. We're not on Twitch. Jesus. We're not on Twitch. A man is talking. John, here. we don't do that here on YouTube. We're progressive over here as well. I'll, okay. Go ahead, Adrian. Oh. I'm just confused on what just happened. Because look, here's what I'm trying to say. Here's <laughs> <laughs> go ahead, go ahead. <laughs> should I be scared of TwitchCon or no? Uh, you should be around me and then go home if you're going to go party. Your partner but... now, yeah? Yeah, but I'm also around all the other girls from my podcast. So because I'm gonna... I'm scared because I can't go to the partner lounge like with my I'm going with girly and girly's not partnered, so I don't know who I'm gonna go to the partner lounge. Dude, the partner me. lounge is so cringe. Why do you guys <laughs> care about that shit? Oh my god, there's nothing good. It. There's literally nothing cool been. or good that ha it's, there's nothing in there. You walk in, there's like six tables with a bunch of people oh. that stand around and touch each other's ass, and then you just walk out. There's literally really? nothing. Yes. There's no yeah, food. True. No, is there? I think okay. there might be like chips. Oh, there's muffins. I thought there was gonna be like a buffet. No, Jesus, what do you think? This is fucking Caesars? No, there's nothing. The partner <laughs> lounges are cringe as fuck at every TwitchCon. Oh, and you can Damn go it. if you're a partner, they'll give you like a hoodie. <laughs> Something. I don't know if they got the budget for it this year, but. Oh my God, I want a hoodie. But what's the partner party then? I've never been to that. Uh, Sometimes Twitch has parties afterwards. Those are- It's, it's me and John's first TwitchCon partner. Nice. <laughs> Those can be better, but they're usually really, really, really packed. It just depends on what you're into. Yeah. Packed? Yeah, there's like a lot there's of that many people. partners yeah. on the goddamn platform. 
It's just a party where people smell like shit. <laughs> Am I gonna so get kicked out of it for saying that? I hope so. <laughs> I wanna go? <laughs> what the fuck? But yeah, I've heard that people don't use deodorant and I, I don't remember TwitchCon that No, well. I remember on my flight back from uh, California to Michigan, the guy next to me did not use deodorant. It was a really painful, like, three and a half, four hour <laughs> plane the, ride. The funniest thing that ever happened, I was on an airplane with one of those guys wearing a Discord zippy hoodie. Nice, spaced. What a fucking and Chad. Yeah, zippy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And I'm like, man, where'd you get that hoodie? I used to think it was a cool thing. I was new to all this. And he's like, well, see, you get it when you get partnered. I've got 600 people in my Discord. so And he totally <laughs> fucking, like, egoed me. And I was so shook, right? I was so yeah, shook. Was, this fart. fucking dork is egoing me. And I said nothing. <laughs> and Tur Turbo turns to me and we're shook. We're just looking at each other. And he's like, well, Zirko, why don't you tell him you have 11,000 in your Discord? And I said, because I'm not partnered. <laughs> 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 I used to think it's such a big deal to be partnered. I me found too. It like, I used to think it's like, oh my God. I used to think that for the longest time. And then once I got partnered, it's like nothing really happens. Yeah. Right. I thought I was getting a better rev split, but then it happened. They ended up branching out like a ton in the affiliate program, such that I don't even know if there's because there used to be a big jump going from affiliate to partner. You used to not get uh, money from ads at all in yeah. affiliate. Yeah, well, a long time ago, affiliates couldn't have subs either. <laughs> affiliates used to have fucking nothing. Um, is it why people say you're rich now? Is YouTube that great for you? Yeah, YouTube is wild, dude. Oh, okay. Are you, have you said any figures live? Um, it's a lot. A lot, like, what are we talking here? I don't know. Well, now it feels weird. Now you're talking about money, like I'm flexing on you yeah. or something. You're making me feel like an no, asshole. No, because everyone said to me, John, stop trying to get him unbanned. He doesn't want to come. I'm like, yes, he does. My biggest flex is that I paid off my credit card once. Based. It is now maxed out again. Stop. I, <laughs> what did I tell you I when I saw you? It's Dumb frozen fuck. in the freezer, but it's also on my Apple Pay. <laughs> This is a higher month than normal, but this is like, like last month. I, I, I pressured Sneeko to buy a ticket, so he's coming to TwitchCon too. Nice. Yeah. Because yeah. uh, the after convention is what Destiny is going to be at, right? <laughs> we'll see. What does that mean? That, that means like he's not allowed in the convention. <laughs> I can't ban from Twitch, so I can't even go into the convention center. Yeah, that's kind of weird. a weird rule. That's such a... What a world. But people who are like banned on Twitch like... Because they're harassers and other people's chats can like just make another account and buy a ticket. Crazy world, huh? Yeah. Yeah, anything else new with you guys? Um, chilling. just chilling. Yeah. You know. I remember a year ago today, we'd all sit till 4 a.m. in John's Discord. Yeah, I don't recommend that. People, like. <laughs> Like, I used to do that where I stay in VC with people, and then after making good friends with some of them, they'd be like, hey, John, I made some art for you. And I'm like, oh, art about me? And they're like, yeah. And they post the most HD. <laughs> it's like the highest level Photoshop I've ever seen in my life of a photo of me in a Nazi uniform. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like... I'm like, dude, that must have took you two months to make. Like, because I really got pissed. I was like, why would he post that in the general? And I'm like, who the fuck never stay in VC with randoms, bro? You don't know who you're talking to. Oh, yeah. you're too good for randoms in VC now, huh? That was the first time I wanted to yell at someone, but I saw how much effort they put in the artwork. <laughs> <laughs> and and he, he's so stupid. He commented before I banned him. He's like, I thought you looked dashing here. And I was like, fuck, this guy just banned his ass. But yeah. Remember like when super you soft spoken guy. Remember, yeah, remember when you blocked me? On Did Twitch? I, I blocked you I off the I couldn't even Discord? type in your chat. I couldn't. I no, not that you have... on Twitch. You oh, blocked yeah, me yeah. because I called you cringe. Yeah, but you didn't. Wait, you do you, that's not why you blocked her. You never told her? No, no, no. I, I legit didn't get called cringe ever by a girl. She was calling Jackson cringe, but she said, you guys. Damn. That's what I was mad about. And yeah, I, because we're at a party and everyone is like really excited to see John because like, you know, they've known John and then he's sitting there like just standing in the corner with Haas and Jackson. Oh, and no. we were talking about politics. Oh my so, god, you oh, were okay. the guy in the corner of the room. You were the <laughs> meme. 
You were actually Literally. the meme. Oh no. So that's why I was like, John, like go say hi to people. And you're like, no, 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 I'm okay. I'm like, John, you're being cringe. <laughs> Because, and he because took it really of seriously. because Bullet ruined the party for me. I walked in and some guy turned his head, and he's like, "Dude, you're the most famous guy here." And Bullet says, "That's because everyone's said that at." To you? Yeah, and, and Bullet turned around. And she's like, "That's because everyone's at the streamer awards." And I was so mad at her. I was like, "Let me, <laughs> let me live, bro." But uh, no, Adrian, you called us cringe because we were talking about politics. And a lot of people in my yeah, chat Yeah, at a said, streamer awards watch party. Adri, 80% of my chat said you were right. If Zerka goes to a party and talks politics with people, then he, that's cringe. I remember fucking Jackson yelling at my friend. He walked in, tripped over a trash can. Everyone was like, what the hell is he doing here? Like, Why can't he talk about politics at a party? And Why? then... My friend with half pink hair was like, hey, like, why were you so rude to Adriana? And then she's like, I'm sick of your liberalist agenda, Kinsey. <laughs> and I'm like, bro, what? Like, what does this have to do with anything? Who the fuck are you hanging out with? Bro, your friends sound like more losers than mine. What are you, what are you doing? No, was... Yeah, well, we got attacked by Nina. She's like, first she's oh, like- Oh, wait, Nina Haas's friend? Um, Nina Razor's Nina. Oh, I don't know who that is, I'm sorry. Yeah, Nina? she turned around. And she's like, Zerka, I know you're cool, but I still get fascist vibes from you. And wait, is Nina, wait, is Nina the crazy tanky girl that Haas was bringing to like her his fucking no. uh, communism shit or whatever? No, no, no. Nina is Razor's wife. Oh, okay. I, never mind. I have no idea. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. And. Uh, but yeah. Yeah, That's but then uh, I wasn't even mad at Adri till eighty percent of my chats like, why are you talking about politics at a party? And I'm like, dude. What the fuck? Like, Destiny does... No, he doesn't. Do you? Do what? No, you don't. Wait, you do don't I talk what? politics at a party. You just small talk. Uh, no, I just don't go to parties. <laughs> yeah. No, I, I, I felt so weird there because someone uh, turned to me and said um, they were, like, trying to convince everyone at the party that I'm, like, working with Alex Jones and I'm a bad guy and stuff. I'm like, dude, I wish. True. <laughs> Who's Alex Jones? Base. Whoa, get the fuck off the call. Oh. Google him. <clears throat> What's next He's for your uh, streaming career, Adri? What's your, what are your next big plays? I don't Whoa, know. Whoa, what does that mean? What? Yeah, I'm just asking what she's like, know. what kind of content she's going to do. What do you mean? So what was her last big play, Steve? I've been, um, Trailing before Minecraft. any of this happened, I, I've been focusing on YouTube a lot and making YouTube videos because I've always liked making videos. And, um... Mm. And like just like planned streams. Because... Yeah, no, I agree. Hassan Piker is a lunatic. What? <laughs> what? I tried doing streams where I'd stream for like twelve hours at a time, but it's just like I just don't feel like it's valuable to my audience. I guess. Yeah. They just don't want to stay there that long. Hey, could you quickly platform my art? I just wanted to show you guys how good I am with the mouse. It's very hard to be an artist on MS Paint. Look at what I just did. Okay. <clears throat> Steven, show everyone. What well, am I I'll looking at? Fridge. You know with a mouse how hard this is to do. I don't know what I'm looking at. What am I supposed to look at? Here, I posted it. You know with a mouse that's hard to do. <laughs> Fuck is so funny. I like it. I like it. It's amazing, dude. Wow. I just, I like when like, I like imagining you doodling. It's like really wholesome. I like it, John. Wait, you drew all of this with just a mouse? You didn't use like the circle tool or the line tool, John? No, I did. So you fucking saying, lied. Godcaster, welcome to upgrading to tier four membership on YouTube. Thank you. You fucking lied. Wait a minute. You can you you use the circle tool with the mouse. You lied. <laughs> you use Photoshop with a mouse. Okay. So do you think it's impressive to use Photoshop? So why didn't you believe Adri's story in the beginning, Steve? <laughs> because it's a woman. I don't believe women ever. Base. Well. Steven, do you find women chaotic? Um, or sometimes. more chaotic than men? Just curious. Uh, what is... Um, do I find women more chaotic than men? Mm-hmm. Um, I, I, dude, I don't even know how to answer that question. <laughs> of, of course you don't. 
Someone sent me something very wholesome. Did they? Yeah, I'll show you. He said, yo, I made you something. And it's a heart. with." What happened to Vosh? Adri, have you met Vosh yet? I don't know who that Cute. is. She I doesn't know, know any of the about. political people, dude. Oh. Yeah. It's my favorite part of this channel. You versus Vosh is my dream content right now. Yeah, well, he's never going to talk to me. His sub really wants me to chat with him, too. Because you're dangerous to be platformed, or why? <clears throat> well, no, because he sucks at talking to people that disagree with him. Mm. And he doesn't want me to mog uh, him politically, you know? Hold on, hold on i got to get some agua. <laughs> okay, dude. So how's um Florida? Are you okay? Isn't there a hurricane? Um, it's uh, not near me. Oh, okay. Is it fun there? You go out to the Miami clubs? Uh, clubs, no. The beach is nice, and there's good restaurants, though. It's all really expensive, but... Yeah. I love the restaurants there. Do you? Which restaurants do you like? Name three. Um, there's this one that was in a hotel. It's like a famous hotel. Okay. Based? It's like with like the wall with a bunch of lamps. I don't know if you've been in there. The I, wall with I lamps. I don't know, dude. I don't know. <laughs> okay. I, don't, I live down here, so I don't stay in the hotels down here. I know, but the restaurant in the hotel is good. Okay. I'll, I'll believe you. Um, yeah, I don't know any others. Okay. Based. What about... Is this the first TwitchCon you're going to? My second. Yeah, not to interrupt the boring talk, yeah. but did you guys book your hotels? No, I haven't yeah. booked anything. Same. You're fucked, dude. Well, I have. No, I, I'm going to get something nice. I'm going to get a nice hotel. The first time I went to TwitchCon, I met John Zerka in real life, and we became twin. Adri, I have to say this without trying to sound like I'm bragging. You're the first girl I've ever spent that much alone time with who did not make me feel uncomfortable by touching we me, even ru alone. rubbing, rubbing me or, you know, Adri, <laughs> I don't know if you've seen it with your eyes, not in a, like, I've been molested way, but you're the only one who doesn't cop a feel with me. You know what I mean? And. Oh, like when I, you came to Austin? Yeah. Like a lot of times if I spend alone yeah. time with a Twitch girl, she'll like, when I'm talking, put rest her hand on my chest and I'm like, bro, mm -hmm. what the fuck? And uh, well, people think I'm memeing about the um, crazy slick thing, but I'm not. There's a bunch of weirdos uh, that go to that are on the website. That's like a fact. Yeah. I'm telling you, like, Steven, mm -hmm. I'm sure you've dealt with this. Oh, yeah. There I, don't, I don't think I draw that type Adrian's of crowd, you know? Cool. Adrian's just cool. She'd be like, yo, do you need tea? Do you need this? But uh, yeah, now I just realized how bad this all sounds. It's my bad. <laughs> Holy okay. shit! That's okay, dude. Keep going. Cause I I said chest. I was trying to say. No, yeah, it's all good, on. dude. Keep going. Is this Freudian or what the fuck is no, happening? No, just it's here? yeah, you know, it's all good. This is so bad. Let's talk about something else. No, I mean like. You know what I'm saying, Adri? Because I've said it <laughs> yeah. to you a year ago. I yeah. said it to you in person, Adri. Save me, you fucking. <laughs> no, you did. I'm just, you're doing great person. right now, dude. I'm you watching. You did say. You said like, oh, like, I like. I don't know. You were just respectful and everything is fine. You How did he know. say it? Was he like, w wouldn't it be so funny if you touched me, LOL? Is that what you're doing, John? <laughs> no, he did not say nice. it like Nice. Good that. one, John. <laughs> Real smooth, saying, dude. Like, he was like, he said this, Adri, I'm so glad that you are like the one Twitch girl who has not hit on me. Because yeah. Adri, you can't trust these girls. Yeah, because you can. They, they're just obsessed with me. But Adri, I just really appreciate how, you know what, Adri? You have a good soul because you talked to one of my mods once. That just means you really don't care about numbers. And I like that about true. you, Adrian. True, true. We love That's dogs. exactly what he said. And it, it sounds like weird, but everything I say sounds weird until it comes true. So mm -hmm. just wait. Oh, okay. Just You've wait. got like train syndrome. What did What's that mean? What did, what is Train wrecks is like the same shit, right? Like always seems hyper paranoid. Always seems Whoa. like really fucking. You just launched a rocket. <clears throat> Yeah, he always seems like really nervous about everything, but then, or it always seems like he's full of shit, and then, and then stuff comes true. No, but Train sounds like he doesn't. Sound, when I talk, I sound like I'm trying to sell you something. Like I sound very shady, but everything I say is very honest. Ask me anything right now, anything. Go. Uh, who's the last Twitch girl you slept with? Uh, Miss PBJ. <laughs> Who? Miss PBJ. 
I don't know who that is. Okay. Girlfriend? Hello, guys. I'm not a degen like you guys. Oh, my bad. <laughs> Fuck off. Yeah, I think I'm in love. I'm not a degen. That's cute. In a cringe kind of way. Do you really think I'm a degen? No, nah, no. Nah. Adri, you cool. Although, Adri, like, old jokes aside, I don't think you should be networking right now in Texas. I'm not. There's... What do you mean by that? Why? Because there's a man out there who is literally the son, of the holy trinity. <laughs> he is the father, son, and the ghost. And he is mad. Yeah, I am slightly scared of that. Wait, do you <laughs> the... guys get security for TwitchCon? No, I got my fucking left and right hand. In what a video. about you, Steven? Uh, same, you know. No, there's no one who's gonna fight us at TwitchCon. No, people talk a lot of shit in real life or online, but they don't usually do anything in real life. Yeah. Okay. That's just my concern, you know, growing up in Detroit. Yeah, but uh, Adri, I don't think you saw Claw in Detroit, you know. <laughs> 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 yeah. What do you mean by that? Um, are you I saying Claw wouldn't do anything? No, are you challenging? Are you calling him out? Don't farm. Whoa, don't farm. No. Don't farm. See, you, Steven, you're farming until you turn on CNN, bro. Then you'll regret it. Uh, if I'm feeling, if I showed up on CNN because of Claw, I probably wouldn't be alive to watch it, so. <laughs> that would be CNBC, actually. Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> um, but yeah. Who's the last girl you fucked, Steven, since we're being honest? Uh, your mom. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. I heard hey, John's mom. Hey, you know nice. what? You know what, Steven? What's up? I gotta say, just because you said that Don't to me. Don't be cringy. What? I gotta. No, I'm gonna come clean. Now we're even. <laughs> yeah, okay, dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Wait, you're not streaming, right, Adri? No. Okay. Do you think Slicker's going to TwitchCon? <laughs> Uh, I offered to buy him a ticket and he said no. <laughs> he said, what? yeah, you can buy me one, but send me the cash in crypto. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no, I actually did offer and he's like, I like you, but no. Because uh -huh. I was like, you'd be great for my channel right now. You want him on the channel? I would love to have a platform slicker, yeah. Why? I mean, this is a guy who's never done anything wrong. Like, you know what I mean? Like, yeah, with all the Twitch trauma money. going on right now, what this guy did nothing wrong. Like nobody even remembers what he did, so he must be innocent. Yeah, is that how that works? No, trust. Look how that happened. You know what I mean? Yeah. Why y'all guys so quiet? I don't know. John just makes everything. He just sucks the whole vibe out of the room. Just makes it fucking. Yeah, a, a lot of people told me yeah. if I stop talking, there's a void. What is that about? Can I not? Can I? Can I doodle? What the fuck? Yeah, do some doodling. Can you draw me something? Adrian, why don't you bring a topic? I'm commissioning huh? a piece, an MS Paint art from you, right now. I don't. I'm not curious about anything because I'm caught up to speed with everything. But like, what's something I missed? What happened? Uh, I miss some of the Sneeko stuff. What do you guys debate about? You guys like talk about red pill, right? <sighs> yeah, it's just dumb shit like that. Yeah. Yeah. It yeah. seems like Steven, It seems like you came around to a lot of the red pill stuff. No, I don't think so. Not at all. Oh, so. remember, you went on Fresh and Fit. Tell me about that. Um, remember, I was supposed to go in there. Oh, he loved them. Yeah, we just What's uh, guy, we just fight with a uh, about red pill. Which which guy? Fresh Fit, Myron, Sneeko? Oh, Myron. Yeah. The balding one? He he shaves his head. He's not balding, okay? Oh, okay, okay, my bad. Damn, you guys are haters in here. Jeez. No, I mean, I used to be yeah. an avid fresh and fit watcher. They host me. I love them. Really? Yeah, they've hosted me when they were growing, so I really like that channel. And I agree with Myron. I don't know. The other guy who sounds like he's got a sock in his mouth, not so much. But Myron, Myron is pretty spot on with a lot of like. What's the worst Myron? Take? I feel like um, what's the other guy's name? I feel like he just agrees with whatever Myron says. Is it Chris or is it Walter or? Chris is the guy Chris everyone is the hates. Recruiter, yeah, Chris is the recruiter guy. I think Walter is the. Is his name Walter? Am I making that up? He's got a weird. Like, he's got a name. Like I would never. 
He's no, fresh, Chris, right? Yeah, Chris the fresh the guy. guy who got, Chris yeah. got crucified because he did a live stream saying Melina's not hot and everyone's like, you're a liar and shit. Is that correct? Something about that. Wait, saying you're yeah. a liar? No, yeah, my chat saw it and my chat was like, he's totally coping, he would fuck Melina, blah, blah, blah. Oh, something. It was just cringe shit. It's just dumb. That whole world is fucking cringe as fuck. Do you have a th what do you think? What are your thoughts on one ended open relationships, John Zerka? I'm curious. Um, I, honestly, I, I don't give you shit for it because I don't think you've ever promoted it. No, 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 no. Do you know what I'm talking about? <clears throat> oh, one ended. So you mean red pill one ended? Yeah. Um, like the guys who are like, you yeah, have to be loyal, but I'm going to sleep with a bunch of girls. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah. So I have two takes. One is my genuine take. Uh, I believe in marriage. I believe in a traditional home. God, and you're so cringe. The, that is the basis for good mental health. Oh is, my is, God, dude. That is the basis. Every Anyone you've ever met mm -hmm. from a broken home, they're coping. That's okay. the truth. Gotcha. Okay? Cringe. You, it's very hard to have good mental health with without parents around. I'm sorry, <coughs> dude. I know I you want to live in your fucking retard world. That Whoa. What? 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 Why you gotta cool. say the R slur? Yeah, why you gotta say R slur? Retarded world! What the fuck? Oh Stop. my god, Why you dude. keep saying it? Not cool, man. I didn't say retard. I said retarded. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I'm acting like a retard. I'm sorry. Jesus, John. But not cool. You say the N-word, Steven. You're way worse. Yeah, that's different, though. Okay. <laughs> what the fuck? You better chill, what? dude. <laughs> me. All right, don't call me. It's I like... personally believe that one day... I want to fall in love and get married and have a farm. Cringe horse girl. Yeah, but I, one, I don't. I don't like horses. I want check chickens. Check it out. The here's what I hate about Red Pill is they'll be like, "Yo, women are the worst thing. They're so dangerous to keep around, and they're just gonna fuck everything up." But yo, surround yourself by a lot of them. Oh my god, bro! What a crazy and novel criticism of the Red Pill people. Where'd you get that one from? Yeah, but the, it's not real Red. Real <laughs> Red Pill. Read Red. Read, read. Fuck me. I can't do it. You okay, Dan? Real, real Red Pill is about um, a home, about making a family. Uh, my right. problem with it is the. Stephen, you're married, okay? You understand marriage. <clears throat> I just don't like the objectification of women because it's it's. Like teaching Fuck it, I'm saying it. Men. I'm saying it. Oh, Any oh woman over the age of 23 without a boyfriend is a fucking loser. Jesus life. Christ. I don't give a fuck. Without a boyfriend? What about a girlfriend? Ooh. Seems kind of homophobic. Ooh. Are you homophobic, John? Nah. You sure? You don't, are you sure you don't <laughs> hate gay people? I like how he said, I, nah. No, no, I don't. Not even a little bit? Okay, here's the deal. <laughs> I. What if I, I had a girlfriend? My problem is... All right, here's my problem. What is end game if you don't have a family? Like, what is you end game? You can adopt for? a family. Sure, but what is end game without a family? What's the what's the alternative for a 40 year old man? Traveling. What? <laughs> okay. That's end like, game. Like, if you have like a relationship and you travel the world and. And then you find somewhere you really like and maybe get a farm and settle down. No, no, I'm saying without the settling down part. What do you mean? Well, you can just be like the red pill people and be like 40 old men in the club cheating on their wife being like, fuck these bitches and like drinking goddamn uh, Maker's Mark Manhattans. Ooh, is that yeah, what you want to be like, John? No, because my red pill is MAGA. We're actually pro-family. <clears throat> you don't miss Donald Trump, Steven. Fuck no. Yeah, that's what I thought. Anyways, I just don't like how red pill is objectification, the objectification of women, because it's kind of like they don't really see them as people, and that's something I've struggled with a long time. True. Cool. Okay. <clears throat> Adri, what? why do women objectify themselves, though? What do you mean? Or, like, like, what, do you, Adri, what's your take on saying the word slut, calling someone a slut? Calling someone a slut? Yeah, like, what, when someone uses that word, what do you th what do you think of that word? I don't know. I mean, it depends on the context. I think there's a lot of, like, women who are, like, trying to take back that word. And, you know, I'm all for whatever makes them feel empowered. But a lot of people use it in, like, a negative connotation because it's kind of, like, it's a negative word. 
Yeah, I agree. But have you noticed that women use it on each other when they get mad at a certain friend? And they say, God, Becky's such my a fucking slut. My friend's never called me a slut. How do you know? Maybe not to my face. Ooh. Hmm. But I also don't encourage that language with my friends. Have you ever used it? No. <laughs> I'm serious. <laughs> You've never said that word? I've never called anybody a slut. In your life? It feels weird to even say it. Tell, wait, life. wait. You don't believe her? Can you say that? You don't believe Adriana? Can you Fuck just, no. Just say that. No, no, just say that. I want to hear you. You I, don't believe her. I, John Zerka, do not believe the girl on the call here, Adriana. Okay. Bruh. Wait. Nice. What's the worst that could happen with that? Guys, stop farming. But no, Adri, you have said it. Like, come on. Um, Adri has an OnlyFans, but talking about objectifying? Lol. Said someone in the chat. I do not have an OnlyFans. Yeah. I have, copio I have the copium version fan house. <laughs> I hate that fucking website. <laughs> you guys are horrible people, dude. No, I stopped doing it uh -huh. ever since all this because people just wanted to find a reason to... Well, she she had to have, have wanted it when she was asleep because she, she, she has a fan house. Like, bruh. I was doing that to pay my rent because obviously I can't pay my rent right now. Damn. Really? Because you know I was super against doing that kind of stuff. You can't pay rent right now? I mean, like these past couple months, I have two jobs now. Hmm. Wait, what? Do you say what your jobs are or? No. No. Oh. She's a nerd. But people don't go crazy. But yeah, I need to get a roommate here soon. Is this for me, John? Uh, I thought Steven should show everyone, yeah. <laughs> Just... It's, um, it's, it's Steven being a detective on your cake. Oh, I'm supposed to be wearing blue, not yellow. Oh, fuck. Wait, it's purple, your Oh, your it's jacket. the blue jacket. No, it's a fuck. blue jacket. Yeah. Can you wear that to sh that, Let uh, me update it. Hold on, hold on. Too late. Two no, jobs. No, 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 no. I have it's two there regular jobs that See, I, like, go to in person. What kind of drugs are you doing? I don't do drugs. God, you, not cool. Don't you want to be cool? I do drugs? Yeah, you know that cool people do drugs, right? What drugs? I don't know. Wait, how old are you again? I'm prescribed Adderall, and I take it sometimes. I'm 22 now. Oh, yeah, all the drugs then. Damn. You're an adult. The most cringe selection of drugs is psychedelics. <laughs> John's one of those guys who's like, if it comes Wait, out of a pharmacy, it's safe. I would never do something crazy like mushrooms and LSD. And then he takes a fucking bar of Xanax and goes and gets wasted all night. <gasps> Real smart, dude. Uh, Xanax? What? Xan. Meth guy. No, Wait, um, psychedelics meth? came out during the sexual isn't revolution. Meth, isn't meth just Adderall? Isn't it like the same thing? They're not no, the same dude. thing. They're just they're Changing similar. one molecule is huge. Holy shit, really? Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah, it's not the same thing. Um, mm. why is this picture of Destiny kind of messed up? What happened? Like this little like triangle? Oh, uh, just okay. Just don't focus on the triangle. <laughs> okay, this is your new profile picture. Wait, too. give it to your chat, Steven. This is Jesus. A you're making me go over to my. I'm trying to build factories here, dude. Okay. There you go. Cute. Not League. Yeah, I miss League. We never played League. Who's we? Me and you. Oh, are you... Were we supposed to? I'm not good. <laughs> no, I think we talked about it once, though. So. Oh, well. If you want to be the most hated person in my chat room, playing League with me is the number one way to get there, so... Okay, I'm good. Do you have a goatee still, Steven? Do I have a goatee? Can't you see my face? You know what I look like. Why are you asking oh, me this? Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You're right there. Yeah, you do. I like the beard better when you have the... No, I don't have a goatee. I have a beard. Oh. Are you okay? <laughs> yeah. Okay, dude. Do people watch you visually or is it just audio? Like, I, when I put Steven on, it's audio. Who knows, dude? What are you guys I most... I like watching the factory. 
True. What are you guys most excited for at TwitchCon? What What are the memories that you two are hoping to make there? Um, I'm excited to see my best friend because she's in Canada, so I don't really get to see her a whole lot. Is this a streamer friend or is this a normie friend? Streamer friend. She plays Valorant. Are you allowed to say who girl. it is or? Yeah, girly. Oh, okay. Do you know who that is, John? On girly TV. John knows. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. She's a great person. They met. She's shy and nice and cool. Is she though? And she's Canadian. Yes, and she's Canadian. Yikes. And Steven, you would you would pipe. Stop. Dude, why are you Stop. why are you so awkward? I don't know. Why are you gonna say that? I thought, I thought we're just being I thought we're just being honest here, <laughs> you guys. Alright. Enough. Um but yeah, what are you most excited for? Uh, uh it... honestly, I've been lying. I'm not excited. Really? Why are you, why are you going then? I'm dragging my feet. I have no idea where I'm going. Well, I think you should go because I'm. I'm oh, I'm going for the views. What am I saying? I'm just gonna okay. Lie. Are you gonna stream it at all? Do you even have like a setup to do it? Uh, I have just an my IRL. Phone. I have an IRL setup, but it's just my and it's like an Android. So you have a cell phone. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, but it's like a separate cell phone. <laughs> okay, you have another cell phone. Okay. With a tripod. Wait, a can you can you rent um, the backpacks? Backpack? I don't know. Doesn't um, Justin not work for or the gun rent? Doesn't he not work anymore for Twitch? What? What? Works for Twitch. I should if I can rent the backpack, I will. Okay. Is that okay? I don't even know what I did at the convention last time. Just like walking. <laughs> Stop, Adrian. Why are you baiting me so hard? <laughs> what do you mean? Wait, shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I just don't even know what I did. Were you drunk? <laughs> yeah, stop. No, I wasn't. I just, it's just like there's nothing to do. You just kind of walk. True. And you're like, okay, I had enough here. And then you leave. <clears throat> That's fair. Wait, why are you, you're baiting, baiting you to say I was drunk? Yeah, you're baiting me into making bad jokes. You've done it like seven times, okay? Oh, sorry. Chill. Jesus Christ. My bad, my bad, my bad. Yeah, it is your bad, okay? Who cares? I'm sorry. Why do, why do you gotta blame her? Just own that your brain is going there. True, I will, okay. Yeah. Uh, Adrian, well, if anything I'm I say ever makes you clarify. uncomfortable, there's a red button, just disconnect from the call, okay? Okay, sounds good, but. <laughs> Adrian, I'm gonna if clarify. anything I say makes you uncomfortable, I don't believe you anymore. What the hell? I'm kidding. Go it's ahead. all good. If we make her too uncomfortable, John, <laughs> we can just joke. go over to her house and have her change. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just kidding. Adrian, what were you going to say? Go. I was going to say the only reason I was not drunk, the only reason I don't remember the convention is because there's not really anything to do there. So anybody who's going to TwitchCon, don't get your hopes up. True. <laughs> but what did Steven say? Uh, I agree with her. I just said it true. True, true. I guess people can like do the meet and greets. That's a thing. <laughs> yeah. You can wait in line and then say, "Oh my god." Why are you laughing? What's wrong with the meet? I'm gonna go meet Pokey. I'm gonna go see my my hero. <laughs> Omg, we should meet you Pokey started, together. Dude, you started too much in my head right now. <laughs> Not me. Oh. What is in your head right now? Why is he think he's a joker? Yeah. <sighs> Are you the Joker? Uh, I feel like the kid in high school who used to post Dark Knight joke Joker uh, <laughs> quotes. Yeah, um, that's who I'm becoming. Okay. I thought the new Joker is way better than the Heath Ledger one. Like that Jacquin vegan guy is so good for the Joker. Wow. Vegan guy. Yeah, that guy's good shit. The one from Suicide Squad. Weird <laughs> letter. Huh? <laughs> is he vegan? I know he has a cult. <laughs> Adrian, can I ask you something? <laughs> what? I, I don't want to open up any drama, but... Uh, <laughs> what? Did Maya kick you out of a... Jesus. Oh, my God. <laughs> is that true, or is that hearsay? I remember one day... Okay, let me just clarify. This is not anything new. I've said everything oh I'm saying God. on stream before. So anybody who thinks, this is new information, it's not. You can just watch my VODs back. Um, I was invited to Animal Sanctuary, whatever. I love animals. I love birds specifically. I have, well, I had two birds. One died. 
But, um, so, I was invited, I was in the Discord, and I was like, cool. When it volunteer time comes around, I'm gonna volunteer. And then, um, I see, like, she streamed it. I was like, oh, it must be volunteer time. Must be, like, taking volunteers. Volunteer go, for the bird. Like, no, like, for the sanctuary itself. Oh. And then I go to, like, look it up, and, like, in the Discord, and it seems I've been removed from the group. Damn. Yeah, damn. The Discord is no longer Excuse me, so Maya Misgives Girl removed you. Well, we don't know that. I don't know what else would have happened. Maybe somebody else I removed didn't... her on accident, John. I just know I was not in the group anymore. But on whose authority? And I was stared at, I was stared at, at parties. Yeah, see? Hmm. Maybe they were just thinking how beautiful you were. <laughs> what the fuck? She really must have thought I was so beautiful then because yeah, must have. multiple times. See, I give people the benefit of the doubt here. That's what we do on the Discord. I no, I tried to give people the benefit of the doubt because I was like, okay, I'm just being crazy. Like I'm not. You like, probably were, like, to be honest. I, yeah. I was gaslighting myself. I was like, okay. You she's should have not gaslit yourself harder. Yeah. But then, then my friend Girly, who's from Canada, who didn't even know, like she doesn't even know who Maya is. She goes, who is that girl with the brown short hair staring at you? And I was no, like, she was just she was simping. Maxwell. She was simping 100. percent Who is simping? Short brown hair. Maya or girl? Maya's hair is long, isn't it? Yep, see? She didn't even get the hair right. No, hmm. it's short. <clears throat> it, you mean it was short? Hmm. <laughs> what? This is, hmm. Very interesting. Is it, though? I mean... I like how we're having, um... Do you? Like a lighthearted conversation yeah. about this call. Is and I... And I know people are gonna clip and be like, "Well, yeah, Adriana breathed this one moment, so that must mean that she's hiding something." Well, well you sound kind of guilty that... right now. <laughs> it's funny, Adri, that you no, had just... a, you had a call with Dr. K today, but you're with <laughs> two edgiest <laughs> people on the internet. No, I was supposed to have the call with Dr. K, but damn, um, do you think that's a, do you think that's a little shameless, John, or? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why would it be shameless? Not from Adri's perspective, from Dr. K's perspective. Oh, Dr. K, he don't give a fuck, man. <laughs> that guy's that guy's a businessman. No, I don't Whoa, mind hey. being able to share my story. I'm serious. Like, at the you end seen of the, the day, clip with him? Hold on, wait. At, there's like 90% of the time Adri's talking. You literally just like talk over her and you're like, I know, I'm, why? I'm, I'm, I know, okay. it's over it. Jesus. Okay. Okay. All right, Adri, finish your sentence and then John go. I don't yeah. mind sharing my story because I just feel like there's a lot of misinformation out there, and it's not like, like yeah, this is hard to process behind the scenes. Just my trauma being up for debates all the time. But um, at the end of the day, being able to share my story is beneficial. And everyone's like, "Well, he's doing it for clout." Whatever reason he's doing it, or like reach out to me. Like it was kind of like I, I kind of proposed the idea in his chat. I was like, "Hey, like, can we talk about like um, victims Turn of up the volume. assault?" You can turn it up in your own thing. No, he meant like the actual volume of your voice in real life, I think. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Um, and then he invited me on, and I was like, okay, cool. Like, I don't mind sharing my story. You know what I mean? Why is there silence? We, we're just processing. Okay, okay. You know why it sounds like I'm drama farming is because I don't know everything. But I got to know, were the names of the people who <laughs> saw the crazy slick and Adriana thing, were they leaked the names of the people in the room or no? Wait, what? Say it again, sorry. The names of the people who saw what happened to you, Adri, at that party, were the names leaked or just some of them? Some of them. Okay, so not all of them. Mitch wasn't there, but he was in the same house. Mitch just mixed everything up with <laughs> retardedness. What? He wasn't in the house of the party, but he was in the house when the twit longer was being written. Uh, and so it's over. I can't ask questions anymore? I just... I'm just trying to have a conversation with Okay. All right, all right. To me, it's still fresh. That's why. I understand. <clears throat> it's been a couple of days, yeah. Yeah, can you please be sensitive to John? He needs like. Because Adri, last night I said something wild, and since you, you clarified what I said, yeah, you know, I appreciate that. But I said something even more wild. I said, if Miss Gift gets shot down, wouldn't that make Maya violently guilty? 
like if Miz is get going down, wouldn't the orchestrator of evil be Maya? Like the the one that does most of the puppeteering. What's up, Lex? Right, because if you think of a crime, like if, if it's a murder scene, Miz feels like the driver, and Maya's actually like. I don't know. Man, you're just you're farming hard, aren't you, bud? Yeah, am I, I farming? I understand what you're saying. Thank God. Don't cancel me, guys. All I'm saying is, to me, it looks like Miz is the driver. Maya is the serial killer. And, uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. What's up? No comment. Yeah, okay. No comment. No, yeah, I mean, I was just listening to John without <laughs> le letting me be farmed. Do you like being farmed? No. Okay, that's good. Oh, man, it's still farming if we talk about it? All right, new topic. No. It's all good. She likes it. She's <laughs> okay. Yeah, we had we had to get this. We had to get out of this topic. Um, what do you? What's the last thing you streamed, Adri? The last thing I streamed was Fortnite with Action Man. Yeah, she said that already. John, what's the last I thing you streamed? Fortnite. Yeah, the Christ. greatest game ever made. Which the one? Greatest Fortnite. Game ever made is we Pokemon. We should all play Fortnite is, right now. Pokemon Emerald is the greatest video game ever made. Pokemon Emerald. Why are you so cringe? And then you cringe. can do Ocarina of Time and shit. No, it's not cringe. That's a great take. Fuck is your favorite game, huh? Star Drew Valley or Good whatever. One. It's Star Drew Valley, really, dude? It's you want to go there? Star Drew. I said I Star Drew. I said Star Drew. You Zionist. What the fuck? It's Starcraft. That's his favorite game. No, that's just what I was an ex-pro in. Okay, but nice. Adrian, what's your yes. favorite game? Help us out. Um, right now I like Fortnite, but I really like Kingdom Hearts. Growing up. Yikes. You don't like Kingdom Hearts? No, I'm it's just not kidding. that bad. Kingdom Hearts 1 I played as a kid was actually really fun. Nobody thought that yeah, game was going to be good my, when it came that's out. That's my favorite one. But um, is the first one. The, uh, but I've heard that like 2 and 3 are like it wild. I forgot how it happened in 2 and 3. I still have to replay them. But I just replayed 1 and my favorite part is Halloween Town. Yeah, I like... Hey, do you remember the level of the Holy Talmud? No. What? What's your favorite game of all time, Steven? Probably either Final Fantasy VII or Final Fantasy Tactics. Oh, with uh, Cloud. Um, that's one of them, yeah. Yeah, that's not bad. Those games are goaded. Oh, Maya's in chat? No, oh, shut up. <laughs> John. He said I'm crushing on Adri. <laughs> you know, Hello. anytime I entertain that joke, Jill bites my head off. Dude, I met Jill. She was very sweet. Dude, she loved you. What did you say to her then? I'm just so sad that we didn't get to hang out. Dude, she hated a bunch of people but loved you. I think you said the right thing. Because you guys were leaving and I was like, come party with us. Who like, are you with? Kinsey. Oh, yeah. We oh. just like to go and dance. I just want to party. I like dancing a lot. Wait, Destiny, can I ask you something? Yeah, go for it, babe. John, I love you. Keep farming, Destiny, please. A am I doing good? What's the viewer count? 8,000? What are you normally at? Oh, Lex Friedman <laughs> is here, bro. That guy's actually an idiot. What? Lots of people You're told me to play DGG? Factorio. Yeah. What do you like about it? P.S. Chat. Yes, I know Destiny is a serious political streamer. I watched a few debates and enjoyed it. Thanks, buddy. Um, Factorio is just like, a, it's like problem solving and then iterating on problems you've solved over and over and over and over and over and over and over again, infinitely. How do I become a DGG? Make an account. Is it oh, safe to make an account? It's my, no, I fucking run the site. Of course it's safe. What do you mean? <laughs> like, if I sign in with my Twitch, you're not going to like He's calling me. you a perverted guy. Shut No, I don't Please know. Please stop. I just don't walk me to these jokes. John. He's fine. He's fine. Listen, I get nervous what, like signing in with other accounts. Why don't you believe her? <laughs> Guys, stop. Stop. Adrian, you don't have to be nervous with me. Don't worry, okay? You're, everything's going to be okay. Just trust me, make the account, okay? Everything's going to be fine. You're not going to okay, get I'm, I'm making an account. Yeah. And get some Please depth. confirm your username. I want to tell you something, but I don't know if I should. Like, on yeah. stream, just because it kind of, like, doxes me. Adrian, I, well, you might as well. It probably what has to do with your job. I'm to you. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Adri, you're less than 100 pounds. Don't dox yourself. What the fuck are you doing? Less than 100 pounds? Don't dox yourself? What does that mean? 
if you're a big <laughs> fat chick, then you can dox yourself because you can fight. Like a 200. Oh, yeah. Is that fat chicks can fight now? Is that a thing? Fat chicks can fight. Yeah. What okay. the hell? Never seen Steven, that before. Steven, you think you can beat a fucking obese lady in a um, fight? Um. Come on. I mean, my kid's mom was like 60 pounds heavier than me. I held my own. She never killed me. I said obese. She, I, I don't know. About, I've never fought an obese woman before. I'm not sure. I've never tried. You know why I you haven't? You know <laughs> because why you if haven't? I had, I wouldn't be here to talk about it. Huh? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Okay, true. I don't think you could. An obese woman can punch hard. No, they can't, dude. You're fucking lying. When did you switch up? You used to say Ronda. Remember when you said to Nick Fuentes, you said, uh, he said something about men are stronger than women years ago. And when I first got on Twitch, and you said, if, if I was Ron fighting him on that, it probably had to do with how absolute his statements are. But obviously, in yeah, the you aggregate. You said, what about Ronda Rousey? Sure, Ronda Rousey. <laughs> Listen, dude, there's a, the, of the, Nick is on the lower end spectrum of men for fighting. I'm pretty sure a lot of women could kick his ass compared to the average oh, man. Oh, okay? you have a okay. Minecraft Destiny, server? I'm going to be honest. We used to, yeah. You've destroyed everyone in a debate, but that that teenager, Nick Fornes, he washes you. Like, oh, that, yeah? guy walks, that guy walks all over you in debates, dude. Wait, I have a question. What's Pepe versus Yi? Um, Adrian, you want to be a dg -er? Here's the initiation. What one do I choose? Talk shit about Hassan right now. I don't want to be clipped. Uh, no, if you mean it, you can become a DG -er. I feel like people can make that choice on their own. It's the worst thing Hassan has said, chat. Watch DG Do I pick got... Pepe or Yi? Oh, okay, everyone's God, saying Pepe. That Pepe is the Nazi frog. Yi is the loner dinosaur that nobody likes. But everybody tries Big to. Pepe. Oh. Pepe. It's a huge, huge, huge debate that's raged on through the ages. Yeah, Pepe came with Richard Spencer. It's become kind of a symbol. Okay, let's um, go to the big screen and type in the DGG. Wait, do I have to be a green name? Hi. <sighs> Hold on. What did you, What? what's your name? Is it your Twitch name? Adriana Lee. Is that, is this? <laughs> oh, is that your real name? <laughs> what do you mean, yeah? Okay. Wait, what is this clip? What the fuck? Which one? <laughs> You're eating chicken and waffles with Nick, like you guys met in person. Yeah, you well, like, came down to uh, Miami. Like said, you two will podcast eventually. <laughs> cool. Why did he ask that guy if he's Jewish? I don't know, because he's a fucking border, because he's fucking weird. <laughs> no, no, I think he was being genuine there. Yeah, though. no shit, he was genuinely asking. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. That's the kid who uh, defeated Charlie Kirk, right? Did he? he? Yeah, that was impressive. He like from YouTube. <laughs> Charlie Kirk had a whole meltdown because of his uh, his army. Oh, you gifted me? Thanks. <gasps> Wait, you have MMM in here? Oh, gee. I get to spam again. Nice job, Wow. Wait, did they remove that from Twitch or something? Or... Well, I mean, you're not on Twitch, and then I do it in your YouTube chat, and then... Oh, yeah, you would just type it and fucking leave, like an annoying, attention-seeking piece of shit, I remember. That. Okay, I, I've, got, I've got a take that I know you guys are gonna attack. Wait, wait, don't say it. Let me get a... I need a soy up. Hold on. He, you drink Soylent? Oh, my God, that, I thought like, that was a meal meme. replacement? I thought that's a meme. Liberals actually drink that shit? I used to drink it when I wasn't able to eat. You're both kind of like weak looking. But it like, wasn't like Soylent the brand. It was like the Costco brand. I don't or like get... the the Amazon brand. Let me find it. So what is the benefit of Because being a... when you are staying up and editing and maybe you've No, no, why not a protein raw? shake? Why not a protein shake? Like I'll there's... tell you on Sunday. There's nothing more euphoric than an empty stomach with a protein shake first. It yeah, feels you think so? so? Good. Well, yeah, yeah. The the problem with uh, high protein diet is when people slam carbs and fats around it. I drink these things. I put them in. The, they're uh, organ. Stephen, put it up to the camera. Sorry, Adri. I want to see the soy. Put oh, up okay. the camera. Uh, it's what just do you a drink? soy one. But why? Why not a protein shake? Because I haven't worked out today. So why would I drink a protein shake? I don't need the protein. Why wouldn't I drink something that has a better balance of macros and just fucking sixty grams of fucking protein? What's the point of that? For an elevated protein synthesis, you, I don't, you don't you don't synthesize proteins if you haven't worked out for the day. 
Y yes, I have nothing do. to synthesize. No, I don't. Oh, it, my muscles are atrophying right now as I'm sitting with you on this fucking call. Do you, do you think Canute, on his days off, lowers his protein intake? No, I. Yeah. Why? So why? Why? Who cares if you didn't work out? Hold on. You're making him mad, John. No, I just don't get soy because I read so much bad shit about soy. What's bad about soy? I like soy. I I had tofu earlier. Why do you got you guys are government? Hey, there. Profit. I typed you top secrets. I hate you. You're gonna kill yourself. <clears throat> oh, what am I reading, Steven? <sighs> Whatever I DM'd you. What do you mean? Sweet no, vanilla bean. Da, 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 da. Yeah, this sounds like the government is trying to give you gyno, bro. Like actually Steve. true. Actually true. The human body is meant for meat and fruits. How many fruits have you had? Did you have a kiwi today, Stephen? Meant for meats and fruits? Wait, do you guys eat the skin of the kiwi? Because someone told me they did that, and I got really scared. Yes. What the, the yes. fucking pubes? Skin kiwis like, alive. Eat the, yeah, the the fuzz. Like I don't eat that. I usually eat it with a like eat the inside with the spoon. But people eat the outside apparently. I don't get why you guys trust government science so much. Can I don't get why it. would we have to? Is this where the conversation needs to go right now? No, because <laughs> no, no, we don't have to go all the way. But I do have a question, Stephen. Like <laughs> in the eighties, when they when they said uh, fats make you fat, so stop eating eggs and bacon, and they mm -hmm. switched it to yeah, a and muffin. eating cholesterol gives you cholesterol. So yeah, just... yeah, yeah. But w when they said fats make you fat, and everyone switched their breakfast from high fats and proteins to muffins, that's when <laughs> that's when obesity spiked, and that was trust the science, trust the science, trust muffins. the muffins. What the fuck? And they were paid off by Kellogg's. Bro, people in America aren't fucking fat because they just don't like m m fucking min max their macros every day. They're fat because they eat a fuck ton of food. They don't get any exercise. That's why people are fat. And because all our food is like ultra processed and super high in carbs. I don't think we're switching from bacon to fucking cupcakes for fucking breakfast, okay? What do you think of the sexual revolution? Do I think, think it's based. I like sluts and whores, and I am but one, it's, and it's I love. Already a, yeah, it's, admitted it's great. To be, it's admitted to be you, this, in this, especially 60s, it's admitted Good. to CIA subversion. Mm -hmm. You don't believe that? That's already declassified. What subversion works is people want it. I love being subverted. I love it when the CIA subverts me. So, and okay, what are you trying to say? Like, if the CIA is crazy slick, what are you trying to say God. right now? Like, what are you trying to say, Steven? I'm saying you, you're being subverted without knowing. You're unconscious right now. That's what I'm saying. Like, they're telling you, oh, soy is good. It's not good for you. <clears throat> I don't know. Adri, I don't want you drinking soy. I think you should switch to protein. Do you like that one? Do you feel awkward there? I hope you did. Which one? You. Oh, oh, with Adri? Okay. Yeah. She's like uh, well, one of my best I friends. I like, I, I be, I'm vegetarian, okay? I'm pescatarian. Really? <laughs> Why did you do that? Oh my Stop. God. How did you it's just switch bad. from vegetarian to pescatarian in one breath? Well, it's like, people don't understand what pescatarian is. They feel like I'm, they think I'm saying presbyterian, presbyterian, the religion. <laughs> yeah. That's what I thought. As soon as you said pescatarian, I was like, you come off no, more as kind of like a Baptist people, to me, but you know, okay, sure, no, Avery. people don't, like, they don't understand what it True. means. True, and you're in the say. lowest IQ fucking Discord in the world right now, so thank you for dumbing it down for me and fucking John, okay? I'm sorry. Just say it's next time girl. you eat fish and sea bugs and, and fucking grass, and we'll understand, and okay? I, Make I'm it nice and real I stupid for us. Steven, I got a question. Yeah. On Wikipedia, it says the penile gland is, it does nothing. Is that correct? Um, the pineal gland? Isn't that the thing that you- that feels like really stressed out when you get super high? <laughs> Am I wrong? Really? I I, I, all I know is that if I smoke a lot of weed and I get really high and I said I feel it in like the front of my head, somebody told me at one <laughs> point in time, they were like, that's your pineal gland. I'm like, okay, if you say right. so. I don't know what it does. Yeah, but the mo modern day scientists say that it has no function. Do you believe that? <sighs> pineal gland is a small endocrine gland in the brain of most vertebrates. It produces melatonin, a serotonin-derived hormone which modulates sleep patterns. So it seems like it does something. Yeah, for sleep, but you know, the ancients have said it does a lot more. Okay, well, I'm probably gonna believe the people that think that your body is more than just four different fucking fluids in balance to maintain your health, right? I'm probably gonna believe modern really? science a little bit more than the ancients, yeah. W why don't you believe the people who print money? <sighs> why do we have to do this? We don't have to do this Stephen, right can now. I just read you something? So we know skull and bones, man. 
Secret society men, yeah, what do right? We know? Secret society men, mm -hmm. right? Who print money. Mm -hmm. I'm not talking about the treasury. I'm talking about the Federal Reserve. These yeah. guys print money mm -hmm. in their books, right? I think this one's called Mystic Masonry, page 180. It says, as the penile gland with the, the rest of form bodies, modern day physiology assigns to it no function. That's what you think, Stephen. Descartes called it, Descartes has called it the seat of the soul. In the average individual, it is small and apparently useless, though it is its focal, focalized position mm -hmm. and symmetrical relations to surrounding structures would seem to assign to it some very important office. It presents a different appearance in the very young, very old, and in the idiotic. Are you telling me, Stephen, there's nothing in your foods to weaken your connection to God? I'm not sure, dude. I'd have to think about that one a lot. What did he just say? These guys who print money, <clears throat> right? Yeah. Federal Reserve chairman write books talking about the penile gland. And Stephen's saying to me it's just for sleep. Give me a break. Weed? <laughs> yeah, see, you guys are just brain-dead, soylent weirdos. <laughs> Sorry, I was talking in chat. Soy weirdos, bro. That's true. I am. I enjoy it. Oh. <clears throat> Am I saying it wrong? Penile or pineal? It's probably pineal or something. <laughs> but dude, you know what, dude? You do you, man. Don't let anybody this take that This is so me. cute. I'm gonna cry. This emote with the fish, like with a hoodie on it, is so cute. Which emote? It's comfy, but with MMM in the middle. Oh. Pineal. Uh, let me keep reading here. You, don't, you also could just not. You don't have to. <laughs> <laughs> From that found in the prime of health. Why do you even have this vigor? book? Because I like to read books from people who print money. Do you know who Klaus Schwab is? <laughs> yeah, the World Economic Forum, right, bro? Yeah, yeah, that's just a conspiracy theory, yeah, right? Him and Soros, dude. They're running it all. Man. Yeah, it's not like they have a book about the Great Reset. Oh, shit. Just join our side, Steven. You know we. You know you like red pill. Are you red pill, Adri? No. Damn. Get her at first. I'm, her. I'm soy pill. Ooh. You gonna let her be soy pill, John? I don't. I don't really have use for soy Adri. Soy or viral pill. Viral pill. If you want a viral pill, you have to sound like Ludwig. What do you mean by uh, that? What viruses always. are we talking about here? <laughs> he does like that thing with like. Like when you speak French, how it's like the, you know what I mean? When you have like that French accent. What am I doing? That's I a lovely thing. Yeah. Maybe he speaks hey. French. Or something. That's like a weird yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> Hey, Victor. Yeah. Victor. Not that there's anything wrong with that, by the way. I like uh, Ludwig. Me it. and Ludwig there's are it. cool. The I last, think yeah. is a cool I guy. think Ludwig is only famous for his great looks because god damn, nobody knows what he popped off for. What do you mean by that, dude? No, he's actually like, what is he known for, Stephen? Go he's answer it right now, Stephen. No, what's he? All right, Adrian, actually, what's he known for? What's he known for? He's actually one of the only. What people did he who pop like, off for? Which let video her fucking game? finish Let's a go. sentence. Which video he's game? He's actually one of the only people who came up with original stream ideas and made content enough to post on YouTube every day, and that is very hard. So I have a lot of respect for him. Okay, Ooh. what is he? How did he come up? What's the video game? Because he actually posts his own videos and then just have his mods do it for but him. But how did? Adri, Ooh, what was dude, she the just video? crushed you, dude. He but what did was videos in the vi like he would like come up with like original ideas or like Yeah, you can't see everyone answers it like that. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, because oh, no way, like, Adri, you're broad. losing it. It's broad. It's a broad thing. <laughs> yeah, Adri, you kinda original. you kinda just got exposed. Adri, nobody can answer this question. <laughs> How did Ludwig he just shot up out of nowhere? I'm not saying I want to see a birth certificate. It's not but, nowhere. He did things like, oh, like doing this with my chat. Yeah, or like what? Doing that like what, track. Adri? Like what? I'm looking right now. No, you can't look. Tell me right now, since he's like, so famous. Higher or lower movie ratings? Oh You're my, you have Discord. to Google it. Well, nobody knows where he came from or what he did. Like paying streamers to do whatever I say. Like these are just original ideas. You didn't have to like sit there and debate Red Pill. That's Blue after every day. he became famous. No, I think that was before too. Nobody I'm knows. I'm scrolling. XQC might be might be known for minecraft steven might be known for debates nobody knows what ludwig is known for Ian, it's the greatest known mystery. For? huh what am i known for you're known for before the crazy slick stuff you're known for the fem feminist stuff 
What? Really? Yeah, it, on depends my on, it depends on where you find me from because I feel like I've done a lot of collaborations with a lot of different sides of the internet. You know, AJ, I'm not going to lie. You're in Ludwig's shoes. Some uh, people know me because of Minecraft. Some people know me because I was an Isaac Y video. Some people know me the girl that went on Lover Host. Some people know me as, like... What is Train known for? Gamba. I'm just kidding, Train. No, oh, my God. I'm just kidding. That, Doesn't he play Russ? Scuff Podcast. Yeah, Scuff exactly. Podcast. Scuff Podcast. All right, Steven, answer it. What is Ludwig known for? I, dude, I don't watch YouTube. Ludwig I have no did, idea. Ludwig um, did Smash. He played Smash. Oh, my God. There, played Smash. There's no one in the chat who can answer it. He's known for being good looking. Just admit it. It's an unfair world. He's really good looking. He's like, I wouldn't, I'm not going to make out with him. I'm You're straight. Not, if he came I'm, up to you and said, John, I'm straight as, please have a kiss. Okay, look, this is a wild take, but I genuinely feel being straight is the most rare thing. I thought you were bi. No, being straight is the most rare thing on earth. People try and say it's the uh, default. It, that's just wrong. Because most men for a million dollars would suck a dick. That <laughs> does means, that make you not straight? That doesn't make Absolutely, because there's men like me who wouldn't do it. If somebody offered you enough, you would do it. So hold on. Are they straight and I'm just super straight, or are they not straight? I don't think that... Come on. Saying yes to a million dollars to suck a dick yeah, makes you not would straight. You, would, okay, okay, hold on. There's there a lot are of women men, who are straight. No, but, no, 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 no. A straight man won't okay. be able to take the cash. That's what straight is. No, that's not what straight is. That's not even what that means. Steven, straight are you means saying... you're only attracted to Adrian, the Adrian, sex. If the man takes a million dollars to suck the dick, how on earth is my opinion the same category? What does so Maya have to do with this? Million dollars? <laughs> I wouldn't take the million, no. You're such a liar, dude. I swear I feel to like God. You, I feel like you. I feel like. Hold on, Steven. Steven. I support Steven, you. I got regardless. offered. Steven, I got offered by Manuel Ferreira to make. He said I could have a Ferrari in two weeks if I open up an OnlyFans with all these girls I know. I said no to girls, let alone cocks, for money. Are you kidding me? Well, having OnlyFans, you're opening up your privacy and private life, too. Well, no, it's just. It's against God. Okay. I. <laughs> Like, no own. offense, Adri, but you guys are burning in hell. Wait, well, who is? Like, you guys. Oh, Pace. And Steven? I mean, Steven is kind of like... He, I have an only fan, in, to be fair, but... The Freemasons talk about how important the life force and semen is. The penis, right? And Steven misuses his cough. <laughs> Can you, why are you so <laughs> fucking weird? What? Oh. What did I say? Lex what? is leaving my chat now, and I'm never gonna get a podcast with him. You just ruined it. Oh, that's the real. I'm Lex. not against. Yeah, what do you know? Do you think it's a fake one that's got a check mark on my chat? Is that the real Lex? Yeah. What the fuck? Not not anymore. Who? Now he's gone. Now he bounced. He's like this dude's fucking weird. Who's Lex? I, I really want to attack him, but I don't want to mess up your day. Well, attack him over what? Like I, I'll just yeah, whatever. Like, that guy's an idiot. <laughs> why are you doing this? Why do you think he's an idiot? Tell me. Fuck it. I'm curious now. Okay, why do you think he's smart? <laughs> I don't know anything about him. I don't know anything about anybody. That's why when you ask me a question about, like, Ludwig and shit, I don't fucking know. I don't answer. I don't watch anybody. I don't have time to watch anybody. I'm too busy he making did. my factories. He didn't respond to my email. That's why. Ooh. This week was the most I've watched content in a while. I like to watch, like, People talk about you? No, I, I like to watch documentary things, Um, like in my normal life where like like learning about the queen's history because i didn't know anything about the queen yeah that bitch is I german saw a video about it so i was like oh, that I'm old sure. bitch that croaked she's german she's german yeah that family's german i like like i watched the history of like the color pink like what just the... random things i like i like learning wait what did you mean the color pink um let me find the video i was just watching yeah, no, the difference for me and Sneeko is I've actually wiped the floor with Steven in a flat earth debate. <laughs> Why do you? Because that you Steven, just, like, never wanted to a that sequel. Back. You never debated me on flat earth ever again. I wonder why. Oh, I, I watch explaining the hyper femininity aesthetic. And I, I was educating myself on that. Why? I don't what know. Do you, wait, have I you gone to, to? You don't have a degree, do you? Yes. I went to school, but I didn't finish. I went to film school. Okay. Whoa. 
Oh, so that's where you learned how to act. Well, it was like a university Stop by name. <laughs> I learned how to what? I'm kidding, you. Know? Ah! John. I'm kidding, you. John. Uh, I was what? actually an editing um, like major, I guess. Adrian, then why do you need so much help editing your... <laughs> I'm just kidding. Can we... What's the next topic? What were you saying, John? Go. We live, we live in a twilight world. Yeah, do we? Twilight? What's your favorite Zelda? Adrian, have you played any Zelda game before? No. Cringe. I want to, though. I just haven't had the time. I think it looks cute and fun. Okay. Let's see what else I, I like to watch. Yeah, tell us. Um, I watched Shark Tank type beat. <laughs> uh, I, to I watch Claw. Have you seen Claw? I watch Cypher PK. First look at my icon skin. Um, I watched Tana Mojo, YouTube's biggest scammer, but I didn't finish it. I watched. Um, Wait, can I? Okay, which guy got canceled for the Suicide Forest? Was it Paul Jake or Jake Paul or Logan, Logan. Paul or Logan Paul? Right. Yeah. What, what, so what did he actually do? Did he just show a dead body he, on YouTube? He recorded a dead body, posted it on YouTube, kind of like joked about it, and then as a result of that, a lot of um, did he actually joke about it? Advertisers, yeah, uh, he like kind of like made light of it, and a lot of the advertisers um, like didn't want to put ads on videos anymore, and that's why like it took away the monetization because anybody anybody who uploaded on YouTube was able to get monetization. They didn't have to be part of the YouTube partner program, but it, it introduced the fact that you have to have like 4,000 watch hours and 1,000 subscribers. Damn. Also, hold on, wait. Can I ask a weird Wait, question? wait, wait, wait. This is crazy, dude. Twitch Korea is forcing their viewers from September 30th to only watch up to 720p max streams due to increased operational and service costs. Do you think Twitch is dying? Holy shit, that's horrible news. 720p? They're downsizing, god damn. Jesus. I thought Twitch was growing as a platform, to be honest. No, it is dying. Oh my god. John, what are you gonna do? They shouldn't have banned me, dude. See what happened? <laughs> they lost their content. Well, I'm rich, so I'm fine, but I was, I love working. Um, you know what you guys got to invest in? What? Is what? Doge. <laughs> yeah. I made a, like a $200 off Doge because I put $20 in. Literally, literally 7 billion people on earth and nobody gives a fuck. I'm going to go grab a drink. Hold on. Do you guys want anything? I'm good. Um, I'll take like a pop. Just uh, say you want a white claw. It's okay. I'm just I'm sorry. What? No, that was a like a bimbo girl joke, not like a sexual assault joke. Oh, okay. Thank you. You're, you're welcome. Fine. Oh, I thought that was a claw no, on Twitch. I, I no, no, not that either. Just <laughs> go get your shit. Oh, God. <clears throat> so, what's up, Adrian? How are you uh, doing? How's life? I don't know. I think a lot is happening, and it's it's hard not to vent or anything but it is really hard on my mental but i'm just trying to stay strong and try my best based what about you uh my life is easy as fuck i just play video games and i talk about other people's lives like yours and then i watch you people have a difficult time dealing with your life while i make money off of it so i think i'm in a pretty good spot well that's good for you <laughs> thanks you know especially because you're able to order food what does that mean? <laughs> like that's like my goal, like to be able to just order food. Oh, don't you don't want to be that? That's like when you've got way too much money to like fucking waste. I know, like people don't realize how expensive. Well, I guess people do, but it's like like streamers who just order food for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Like I just want to be like that one day, but it's okay. When are you gonna cut your credit cards up, Adri? I put them in the freezer. What the fuck is that supposed <laughs> to do? They're in the freezer in an yeah. ice block right now. Okay. However, I got a notification yesterday from American Ex no, Bank of America saying, we increased your credit limit. Fuck. Why they do that? Because uh, you're making your minimum payments. 
everyone keeps increasing my credit limit. I was chilling at 4,000 for Amex and they put it to 8,000. I'm like, why are you doing this? Dude, my uncle was able to run his credit card debt up to like $30,000 and he was showing like 25,000 a year on in income. <laughs> Jesus. But um, hopefully I can, my goal is to pay it off and maybe buy a house. Okay. What, what about you? Would you ever buy a house? Um, well, I kind of own one house right now. Uh, maybe I'll get another. Someone asked me if I'm actually from Detroit or if I'm from... I'm from Metro Detroit, but, like, I know it's very, like... People are really gatekeepy with saying I'm from Detroit when you're in Michigan, but when you're outside of Michigan, it's like you're not going to sit there and say, like, the exact city you're from. So you're not from um, Detroit. Well, because I hear people, like, do you know who Nick Fuentes is? I'm from is? Metro Detroit, but I've, like, okay. moved... I've lived downtown Detroit uh -huh. before I moved... Here. People say some shit like, oh yeah, like I'm from Chicago. And it's like, really? And they'll give you like some suburb that's like fucking 45 minutes away. And it's like, all yeah. right, dude. Yeah. I lived about, my whole life, I moved a lot around Metro Detroit. So I lived always like 30 minutes away from Detroit. And then when I went to college, I lived downtown Detroit um, because that's where my school was. Okay. I'm ever saying what city. I'm not going to tell you. I'm sorry. It was, it was like, always 30 minutes away though um but yeah wait someone said i have a house now but it's a lot of work but it's nice when you get everything you wanted i just want like rent just keeps going up and i only have like a two-bedroom apartment so it's like it just feels like i'm paying way too much for that but i don't know i've never seen a roach in my house i'm scared of roaches why roaches in particular because there's not really roaches in Michigan. There's like little tiny, tiny roaches, but like that's not the biggest bug. I think maybe like earwigs or house centipedes, but roaches are, are like kind of weird. Okay. Like they're really fast and they like crawl up things and they fly. Okay. I remember I was walking around the domain and there's just, it's, <laughs> I was with my friends, I was like, Let's see how many roaches we can find. And there's just so many. If you actually like look, you can just find so many roaches like just get like walking around. You try not to pay attention to them, but then when you actually like open your eyes and pay attention to your surroundings a lot, you see a bunch of roaches everywhere. It's a little gross, but all right. I actually need small talk. No, it's all good. Do you are, do you have like a fear of like bugs in general? Like no, I I when I was younger, I wanted to grow up and be an entomologist. But I um, how much younger? Like nine? Like who wants 18. to be an entomologist or whatever at age nine? When I was in elementary school, I wanted to be an entomologist. Interesting. I had a thing at school called the Bug Club, <laughs> and um, we would like there was like a little woods, like forest, a tiny little forest right next to our um, playground, and there would always be tent worms, but they look like cute little fuzzy caterpillars. So I'd be like, guys, we have to save them, and everyone's like, no, kill them, they're killing the trees. I'd be like, but they're so cute. And then I would catch like grasshoppers and crickets and whatever and like learn about them and stuff. And I was like, oh my gosh, I want to be an entomologist. But then I realized like they don't really make that much money. Oh, so wow. then I wanted to be a singer. And when I was in middle school, I put a song on iTunes when I was um, 12. And everyone at my school seemed to be supportive, but then I moved to a new school and everybody hated me. My ask.fm, that was really popular when I was in middle school, um, was just blowing up of people bullying me. But I still I still made music and I posted, I wrote songs all the time, played my guitar on the side of the street and everything. Wow, that's brave. And, um, but then I realized I liked making the music videos better than I liked making music. So then, <laughs> sorry I'm telling you my life story. So then I wanted to be a YouTuber. But then it never happened. So then I just went to school for film because I did a lot of film stuff. And then I started streaming on Twitch and then it was just a habit and, or like a, not a habit, a hobby. And then I went to TwitchCon and I was like, wait, this is kind of cool. Like there's so many people that are like doing Twitch for a living and like, like they're, a bunch of, they're all friends. So then um, I thought it was just, happy fun time so i was like i want to be a streamer so then i became a streamer and then now this is my life nice old base good job what a journey <laughs> sorry are you though 
Not really. That's I'm cool. glad I can have, like, I can talk about. Don't ever apologize for being authentically you. Okay. Okay. Thank you. No problem. <laughs> what about you? What do you want to be when you're growing up? Um, there are a lot of different things. It just depended on. Yeah, how old I was. I think um, so at some point I wanted to be like a biologist, kind of. At some point I wanted to be a science person, and I thought I'd be a math person. I don't know, just like a lot of random shit. I started playing way too many video games, and so I think I lost my drive to do stuff that wasn't just video games after a while. Mm -hmm. I never played video games growing up, just Kingdom Hearts and some DS games. Wait, how do you how do you go from not playing any video games to just playing Kingdom Hearts? Like, how did Kingdom Hearts come up? My mom and I would play it together, and we would like sit down in the living room and like watch it. Like I would watch it if she was playing, and then like sometimes I would play. Wait, is your mom based? Yeah, sometimes. Wait, how old is your mom? Um, forty. Okay. It's pretty based. She's she's okay. We've had our ups and downs, but as an adult, um, things are better. But um, John has a crush on my mom. Oh, damn. Okay, I don't want to step on John's territory, you know? Well, I don't know if it's territory because she has a boyfriend. F uh, well, wait, is she like open or is it like a closed thing? I think it's closed. Fuck. Cringe. Doesn't she know what year it is? Everybody's open now. Really? Everybody? Yeah, basically. I'll talk to her well, tomorrow. <laughs> Someone said, I don't trust Dre's parents. Oh, it's Apple Orchard. I know him. Um, but what was I saying? Oh. You said your mom was going to consider being open? You want me to call her and ask? Yeah, if you want to. Please. No, it's too, it's too, it's too late. It's like midnight for her. Fuck. Okay, never mind. Oh, she's East Coast. Yeah. She down she here in Florida? Oh, Michigan. Fuck. She loves Miami, though. I'm not going to lie to you. She's okay. obsessed. She's well. always wanted to live there. Mel's traveling. I got my apartment all to myself, so if she wants to come down for a week or two, I can host her up, you know? God damn, I left for a second, man. He, he's talking about my mom. I know. <laughs> John will come down, too. You wanted to come down? We can yeah, We can all three she, hang out. Stop. She, she tried to set me up with her mom. Her mom's cute. Oh, shit. I'm trying to set you up with my mom. You said my mom was cute, and I was like, okay. Yeah, she was back then. Back then, did something change? Yeah, something changed. I'm married now. Oh, fuck. Yeah, man. and my mom has a boyfriend. Dude, chill. How long have they been dating? Since... That would have stopped her. Uh, <laughs> like, March 2021. Christ. A year and a half? That shit's over. She's fucking married. Just tell me that in the opener next time, so I don't like get all these thoughts. Okay, my, my bad, my bad, my bad. You just, like, fucked me super hard. Now I feel really bad. I, I don't want to make... Can I make things awkward a bit? <laughs> oh, my God. Whatever. Go for it. Sure. Adri, would you fuck Destiny? Please, <laughs> okay, John, did you no. chill? <laughs> Jesus Christ. I thought we were streaming. Do you want to make some... You want to throw some more sexual harassment jokes in there, too, while we're at it? Oh, I totally forgot. My bad. Jesus Christ. Anyways. Um... No, maybe this is weird, but when I have like guy friends that are like that give me advice, I like really value their friendship. You know what I mean? The term you're supposed to use is like guys, a brother. That's the anytime a guy yeah. gives you advice, he's trying to fuck you. Is that always true, John? Really? Always true. Even my well, now if John's therapist. giving you advice, now you know what he's after. Hey, take the red pill, Adri. Even my physical therapist. <laughs> That's don't answer that. Stop, fun. stop, don't. <laughs> New topic. Anyways. What kind of I'll advice did you get, it weird. Huh? What kind of advice did you get? That I have to um, do, like, certain exercises and make sure I don't sit for too long because I have a herniated disc in my spine. It's, like, an ongoing problem. Wait, and since I when? Sit. What the fuck? Since Are you I was, deadlifting? Since I was 17. How did, doing what? what? Because <laughs> I worked two jobs and I um, like never slept and I was a waitress and I kind of like didn't walk correctly because I walked on my tippy Okay, wait, walk. hold on. You weigh like 90 pounds. I don't think your body can physically move enough weight to herniate a disc. I don't think that's possible. Well, that I, I did. I was a waitress and I walked on my tippy toes a lot and I always 
was like never taking good care Look, of myself because I, I couldn't afford to eat because unless like, I got you're cut feeding and like you must have been feeding very obese people right like heavy plates right they were heavy plates there's a Coney Island in Michigan if anybody knows um wait who told you what? who told you you have a herniated disc is this a chiropractor I or went what to the doctor and I got an x-ray whoa Adri, that's serious. Because I was, I was telling my mom, I was like, dude, my back hurts. She's like, Adriana, get over it. Like, that's just normal. Like, it's normal. Just go to sleep. You're fine. And I'd literally be, like, crying in class because it would just hurt so bad. And then um, I was like, mom, can you please take me to the doctor? And she was like, listen, Adriana, I, you're paying for this, by the way. Like, I'm not, dude, your mom like, sounds she fucking was just, awesome. Like, pissed that, she was so pissed that I had to go to the doctor. So then I went to the doctor. And she's like, there better be something wrong with you because this is a waste of time. And I was like, Oh, Bruh. my God, you Americans then, pay for health care. Yeah, we do. And that then, shit's expensive, bro. Wait, wait, how much I did you pay? I paid for it. Well, I had a oh, copay of $40, but then the x-rays came back and it was a couple hundred. But, um, but then... I was going to say $40. That's not a doctor. But then I got an x-ray and it was a herniated disc. And they were like, okay, you need physical therapy. And then my mom was like, I don't believe in physical therapy. So I had to sit there and pay for it and arrange it and stuff, which is fine because I was used to doing that. So then I went to physical therapy a lot. And then they're like, okay, you should be good. And then it just kept like happening. And then I went to physical therapy here in Texas. And then I stopped yep. going. So it's like, this is expensive. There's no way like, she has a herniated disc, right, John? Is that possible? Uh, Bruh, do you want me to pull up the goddamn x-rays? I do. I want to see the x-rays. Yeah, I kind of okay, do. I will, go, I will go, to care, I go to urgent care. I'll go to urgent care tomorrow and get another x-ray. Based. I'm getting pics of Adrian. Are you jealous? I'm getting... I'm getting <laughs> I want to see. Adrian, I need to see the medical records. Adrian, don't let him... Don't leak your x-ray. <laughs> <laughs> x-ray shows bones. Yeah, it was like the one of the, the discs was like slipped. Damn. People, chatter, people in chat are saying it can happen. Okay. I, I thought a herniated walk. disc required like major, major, major fuck up. Like you gotta do something real fucked on your back to like herniate a disc. But people are saying- Well, the main reason, okay. I don't want to trauma dump, so I'm not going to, but I'm gonna say I, there's a reason why I walked on my tippy toes my whole life. And um, so I just, because I walked on my tippy toes growing up as like a young girl, my legs, my muscles kind of like, grew that way so i have shortened ligaments in my legs and a main thing i worked on in physical therapy was um stretching that ligament of my leg because i wasn't able to stretch it back a lot because that's why i walked on my tippy toes a lot oh, so then no, I because i walked because i walked on my tippy toes a lot my back like was like curved in a weird way and that's why it was easier for me to herniate that disc because it's in my upper back whoa is it the is it the not stretch the leg just stretch the muscles around it in your thoracic area, mm -hmm. or it's not lower back, Adri? It's thoracic. Jesus oh my Christ. God. It's in my upper back. Dude, like... you, have, you have the worst loadout I've ever heard. <laughs> yeah, it was not, it was not a good time. So yeah, if anybody walks on their tippy toes, don't do it. Jeez, I feel so bad for you, man. What if it don't gets worse when you're older? It might, but I, that's why I have to exercise more, but it's hard to like keep up with exercising and stuff. Is it? I don't know. Destiny just doesn't believe Adriana's story right now. <laughs> I do. I why believe all women's stories. I, I mean, I can provide the x-ray if you need. No, I believe it. you. John was the okay. one that was being skeptical. John is like DMing me. He's like saying like, she can't possibly have it. He's linking me all this weird <laughs> shit. I don't know why. Did but... you get my DMs? Steve? Why did you message me? Which... She's lying again. I didn't even say that. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Adrian, you probably th we're we're joking. I know. Oh, nice. That's awesome. Cool. Okay. It was super random, and he like geeks about it all the time. Nice. My so what what did you have to do fun. for your back? <laughs> um. I'm sorry. I I did like certain exercises, and um, like had to put like heat and ice on it, obviously, and then. Just like certain physical therapy exercises. Jeez. Is that an acceptable answer, John? You okay with that? I mean, I can go through them if you want me to, but oh, no, I'm we just need sure. the evidence for the exercises. Mm, that's bad. Yeah, it kind of sucks and it hurts even now. But. 
Yeah, some people just have hard lives. Like, there's this guy I know, Hassan Biker, who is self-made from the gutter. Like, from the mud. <laughs> really? Did you know that guy? He almost killed himself because of all the harassment he got from my community. I felt so bad for him, dude. He said that? Yeah. He said, they made me suicidal, dude. <laughs> this was back when he was like, guys, I'm so happy for you. I would have never been anything if you guys weren't here supporting me. And now he's like, back then, dude, they made me want to kill myself. It's like, damn. Brutal. That's sad. He loved your community. That's so weird to hear. Is it weird though? Or is it exactly what you'd expect to hear? I understand um like being upset over like hate though. Do you, Adri? You know I, I try I'm pretty like thick skinned. Adrian, do because, you know like, the drama though? No, about... but it's okay, you don't have to tell me. No no for de it's all Destiny's and Hassan's is like public. And basically, it's actually strange because oh everyone God, agreed what? with Destiny's take that you should be able to say whatever you want in a <laughs> private setting. Uh, like, everyone agreed with Destiny's take you can say whatever you want in a private setting with friends and close ones. But they still disagreed somehow. I didn't get that. Uh, Do you remember that, Steven? They said, yeah, you could say it in a vacuum, but you're a bad person. Don't worry about it, Andrew. It's I it's a documentary Hassan. called The History of the N-Word by Destiny and Wait, Hassan. Wait, did Hassan have a DGG account? <laughs> did he actually? <laughs> the greatest question that'll never be answered. <laughs> no, I think he did have a DGG account. I think that was him. Oh my god. What? What's so funny about that? That is the greatest burn on Hassan, dude. <laughs> if he had an account, then it's game over. Okay. What is the account called? Asanabe. I just checked, yeah. You go on DGG. Yeah, he, he hated that community. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. If I do my logs for DGG, it's only DGG. It's not like Twitch. It's only D... No, it's only... It's just my chat. This is like... It's a totally separate thing oh. from Twitch. Okay. Dude, I once hated someone so much, I made an account on his personal website. <laughs> and chilled there till I grew. Oh, well, listen, dude. <laughs> <laughs> My logs are, how is everyone? MMMM. MMMM. <laughs> yeah, basically. That's what your logs are like in my Twitch chat, too, though, so. I just like that fish a lot. Wait, D Destiny, can you play that clip of uh, Claw, the one on my Twitter? Claw, you, you're going to love it, dude. What, the Both one of him saying the N-word? <laughs> <laughs> no, no. I'm good, dude. I don't... No, no, that's the one you really love. Yeah. I'm saying uh, on my Twitter, go watch Claw's music. It's the funniest thing ever. <laughs> no, I think Wes sent me some of His music? No, no, no don't, don't watch, watch it. Don't look at it. If it's what I'm thinking. He makes me sick. No, no, no. Uh, Destiny. No, watch I'm not watching this on stream. Why? You can get banned? Are these the ones that where people made tracks of him beating his girlfriend to like songs in the background? No, 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 no. Oh. I mean, what the fuck? Oh, never mind. Okay. Fine, I man. think he actually makes music on Spotify. Does he? Here, Destiny, they're going to love this. On my Twitter. Wait, how is this? Oh, because it's up and down. I got. <sighs> On your Twitter, let me look. What do you? Yeah, bring his Twitter up. Link it. I'll click it. Yeah, I don't know it's why it's a so screenshot good. and not a link. Oh, sorry. Uh, Somebody said, I'm way behind, but as someone who keeps up with competitive Smash Bros. Melee, it really does annoy me that nobody knows that Ludwig was a commentator in that. There. That one guy oh, said that. Oh, thank God someone knows. Okay, what is this? <laughs> it took like 9,000 people. As I <laughs> why can't we just say Ludwig's extreme? He's probably the best looking guy on I Twitch. That's why he's go got Wait, is this his actual music? Dude, I don't, I don't want to make fun of his music if he's trying hard. Damn, that's mean. I was a musician. We don't make fun of musicians like that here, okay? We respect the hustle. We support you, Claw. <laughs> Please remember that, okay, when you're reloading. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <sighs> you, 
you didn't hear it. I, I'm not going to make fun of it. I'm not going to shit on this guy's music. No, no, it's not about the music. Okay, hold on. Okay, hold on. Let me find it. Too. Okay, I'm listening. This better be worth it. Mute it, mute it. It's No, I'm listening. Mute us. You're fine. Really wish that I could just go live again. No, you're really not. You're never going live again. <laughs> what do you want, dude? <laughs> you're, you're gonna be like one of the first to die at TwitchCon, man. <laughs> Holy shit. I like how John closes his eyes at that. <laughs> <laughs> Which Uh, I got a message from, uh, yeah, from Razor him. saying uh, you grouped him up with Claw and Clint, and he he doesn't want that impression. Yeah, apparently like, a lot of guys got mad at me because I said they were all crazy. Uh, listen, I'm sorry. Some of you might not be crazy. Yeah, Earthly messaged me. A bunch of people messaged me, and they're like, bro, I'm not like that. Yeah, you threw Axion under the bus. What did he do? I Why do I feel like there was some weird drama involving Axion? Am I crazy? Was there not? Maybe I'm wrong. Why do I remember that name? Wait, was it on didn't some Ari and Nina shit? Didn't he sneak into TwitchCon, that's why? Well, I don't remember. I feel like I remember him. Oh, he used uh, Miz's account to auto-host himself. No, that's... I feel like there was some drama. Don't remember. It's the beanbag dipshit. What does that mean? All, that? all I gotta say is Steven... Uh, you and Razor would get along, like, yeah. Okay, maybe, we, I'm not judging the dude, he might be a chill guy. But his wife is crazy, dude. Like, the kind of crazy I like, or like, I'm just kidding. I just, that was a joke. <laughs> Shut up. His wife called me anti-Semitic because I said George Soros. Jesus. Soros bad. I'm not looking for the girls that are anti-Semitic. I'm looking for the ones on antidepressants. You know what I mean? Jeez. Antidepressants? <laughs> you wouldn't understand, Andrew. You wouldn't get it. Okay. <clears throat> Arya Nina. I haven't heard that name in a long time. Um, yeah. But we're cool, so it doesn't matter. We're not here to shit talk anybody. Everybody, this My stream is all about love, okay? I'm so proud of you. Thank you. What else is your stream about? Pulling magics. Oh, yeah. we, what did we interrupt, Stephen? What were you doing? Um, I was probably going to sleep soon, so you're just here keeping me awake, basically. Oh, I can go. No, I mean, I'm... She wants to I go. just woke up go. from a nap and I was feeling a little Don't, Okay, when I, I say somebody just keep me awake, if I, I that's a joke. If I wanted to sleep, do you really think you two motherfuckers would keep me awake? I would just say, leave, I'm going to sleep. Okay. The fact that you even okay. say that is insulting to me. Sorry. Yeah. I woke up from a nap and I saw that you guys were in a call and I just wanted okay. to hang out because right. I'm lonely. That's fine. Well, that's is what that Tinder's for. No? Okay. <laughs> I'm just kidding. What? Huh? Don't use Tinder. Dude, either. I had a Bumble once and I got stalked on it, so I'm good. That's based. I actually have so many funny Bumble stories, but. Tell us one of them. Stream. Okay, one of them is um, I. Met this guy, on, I saw this guy on Bumble and he had a really cool style. So I was like, hey, so what's it was up? a Chad. What do you do? That's what you mean. Yeah, go ahead. No, he had a really cool style. He was like artistic looking. And <laughs> okay. um, he, because I don't really like, like drawing Chad guys. Uh -huh, like, yeah. Anyways, 
So then um, he worked at H&M, and he was like, yeah, I work at H&M. And then I was at the little outdoor mall, and I was like, oh, you know what? I might as well stop by and try to say hi to him. Like, hey, is it okay if I stop by and say hi? He's like, yeah, come on in. So I went with a bunch of my guy friends, and um, I went in there, and I was looking for him, and I was also looking at, like, a certain, like, type of clothes that had, like, Lee on it, which was cool, like the Lee, um, <laughs> you know, the Lee brand, like, pants. <laughs> so... Stop laughing. Listen, so then I went over and I, this guy was like, oh, you're wearing a Twitch hoodie, you stream? And I was like, yeah, I stream sometimes. He's like, what do you play? I was like, Minecraft. And he sat there and explained to me his whole Minecraft lore for like 10 minutes. And I was like, oh, that's really cool. And then I was like, um, then he, I was like, actually, do you know who this guy is? And I like showed him a picture. I was like, apparently he works here. I just wanted to say hi, I met him on Bumble. And then he was like, oh, like I had a Bumble once. Um, but like I stopped using it, but like, uh, like I had a Bumble, blah blah blah. And I was like, yeah, I stopped. U I stopped using Bumble um, as much because everyone just asked me about streaming. Um, and he was like, yeah, you know, I've ran into a couple streamer girls on Bumble, but they all seem really stuck up. And I was like, bro. Oh like, I was like, who? Because like I didn't know, and I was wearing a mask, by the way. I I I know a lot of people in Austin, so I was like, oh, like. Oh my I god, he's gonna say you're about. now. So then he was like, there's this girl, her name's Adriana Lee. Like, do you know her? And I was like, bruh. And then my friend next to me just started laughing so hard he had to walk away. Based. And Based anti-simp. Then, then I was like, that's me. And he was like, no, 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 I didn't mean that. I didn't mean that. And I was like, well, like, did we even like match him? He goes, no, but like, I looked up your name and I like DM'd you on Instagram. And I was like, bruh. And then he was like, can you please like follow me back and like follow my dog? So then I followed him back and his dog. For some reason, and then I was like, "Okay, nice meeting," and then I left. Damn. And it wasn't even the guy I went in there for. Damn. So then I stopped using Bumble. Adri, not to like, uh, I'm not trying to be critical, but haven't you deflowered three virgins? Jesus Christ! Oh God. She has. I'm not talking about this. How do you find three male virgins? Some girls are into that, dude. They're like virgin hunters. Jeez. I'm not talking about this on stream because people are going to pick it apart, but I've talked about it before. I mean, I just really liked the guys, you know? It wasn't having to do, like, with some weird fetish. Mm. I mean, you I really giving... liked them, and one of them was one of my long-term, like, Like, you give friends. virgins a shot. Yeah... Yeah, no. I I'm think not really a sexual person. No, it's noble. <laughs> a lot of girls, uh, their biggest turnoff is like no exp. It's not noble. Some people are just into it. It just depends on. It's not that I'm into not it. An Indian. What the hell? Jeez, I'm what? not into it. That just happened to be the situation. We were with three different watching. virgin guys. No, that <laughs> listen. Once yes. is an a once is an accident. Twice is a strange no, because, coincidence. Three is a no, hobby. Okay. Because one, the first time I was also a virgin it was my first boyfriend in high school. Yeah, that's one. That, so that's, that's your one normal. coincidence. Okay. And then my second one was um, a guy that was a Fuzzy Tube moderator. I mean, him met and we talked for a while, and then we started dating. And then uh, he was a virgin, so I was like, oh, it's no worries. So then, <laughs> that I did. I'm not gonna sit here and shame him for it. And then the third one was just some guy I was talking to for a while, and we were uh, going to date, but then I realized, like, I didn't really like him that much after Oof. a while. Because, Damn. I don't know, people do this thing where they, like, pretend to be someone, and then they, like, get a little comfortable with you, and then they, like, kind of, like, drop the wall of, True. like, pretending to be someone. I do that. I do that all the time. Because I was, like, my thing was, like, I just wanted someone who could take care of themselves and who was, like independent and like didn't rely on their parents and like had like i don't know basic like common sense and um so when i first met him he came over for thanksgiving and he was very sweet and nice and he seemed like he like took care of himself and whatever and i was like cool like i really like him and then he like went back to where he was from and then we would talk on the phone all the time and then he came back over and it's like he was really comfortable and like he didn't even take me on a date. He didn't pay for any of our meals. Wow, like, you're looking for big spenders. 
I just want someone to pay for a meal every once in a while. Jesus. I'm, I'm used to having Savage. to like, You're looking for, for wealthy everything. virgins. Jesus. No, I'm just looking for someone who's going to pay for my meal. Because uh -huh. my, my exes, I've had to like pay for everything for yeah, them because okay. they didn't have jobs. You're over here using Tinder Eats. I see how it is. Okay. That's not. Anyways, so um, it was really sad because I really liked him, but then like he got yeah. really comfortable and yeah. he didn't know how to do laundry. How do you feel about that, John? What the hell? Why is he quiet? Listen to my my song I made. Wow. Okay. What happened to Mr. Girl Guy? He got banned from YouTube. We gotta get him back somehow. I'm giving you both. You're on a five minute timer, okay? And then I gotta sleep. Isn't that the guy who was like sexually aroused by Cuties the movie? No, he was making a point about the thing, okay? He's not actually aroused by kids, okay? Huh. <laughs> Interesting. Who is the 44th president of the United States? I don't know. What, what was the point he was making? Who knows, dude? Someone threw a tomato at dude, me. Dude, what? My Twitter account is actually broken. You know what? You know what, Steven? Somebody what? said to me oh, the God. other day, they're like, dude, Steven was talking to this girl who sounded just like you. Uh-huh. Who was it? It was probably you. <laughs> no, I, it was somebody else. What, did you listen to it on stream? Who was it, chat? No, because I didn't know who it was, and I didn't. no one linked to me yet. It was probably the guitar girl. How do you feel about uh, Coolio? Who's that? Lav? Oh my god. Lav. Everyone's saying Lav. There's no oh, way I'm... Lav sounds like you. I met her. She rage quit my podcast. What's her yeah. Twitch? La Lav Loon, isn't it? L A V L U N E. Lav Loon. Okay, I'll follow her. Why? You don't even know her stream. <laughs> oh, I've seen this girl on TikTok. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, she was a TikTok person. Yeah, Steven, you're Yeah, I followed day, her man. on TikTok a long time ago. Steven, you're what? so funny today. That's so cruel. Why would you say that? Say what? Let her follow. What the fuck? Well, it's just funny to just randomly follow somebody with no background. You just... I don't know. Follows are a big deal to me, okay? Hey man, Someone I said Ludwig. this. You sound like my girl when she smokes weed. No cap, Adrian Lee. It's pissing me the fuck off. I don't smoke weed. Dude, that guy's a fucking loser. <laughs> I'm sorry for sounding that. like your girl when. <laughs> that guy's I'm sorry. Trying, I, I that's a virgin trying to get it with you. Someone said, "Do you free bleed?" No. <laughs> Based. <clears throat> Um, Adrian, your DMs are gonna look like this. You know, it's cool you give virgins a chance. You know, I've, I've been a virgin <laughs> a while and- It I, sounded like, did I say you smoke? Okay, I'm sorry if it sounded like that. I'm sorry. Oof. You just got, how did that feel? I'm sorry, you just got blown the fuck out. Just like do I you always flush do my her. tampons? Is it bad to flush your tampons? Yeah, but every single girl fucking does it anyway. I so. don't flush the plastic part. I put that in the trash. There's a conspiracy theory. Actually, never mind. No, no because I tried using organic tampons, and then I saw something on TikTok saying they gave people cancer. All tampons Dude, I was give you cancer. Using That's the why you're supposed tampons. to free bleed. You're supposed to free bleed. Dude, I was once trying to make a conspiracy take not sound crazy, so I pulled up this video that was helping me out, and then he just sidetracks and says, "A woman's period, the blood is." supposed to be drank by the husband for vitality that's so okay. fucking hot dude. and yeah it oh totally that was the first debate i ever lost because that idiot said that someone said I, me... I used him as my like source and i'm like why did he do that what the fuck like everything else was correct someone said give me a cool name color you can change the color uh i gave you a notable thing isn't that what she's supposed to get no not in discord and uh wait no, why I are you a vegetarian she's not she's a um, oh, I'm, I'm blue episcopalian or whatever a pescatarian is fish. You don't like fish, right? You kill fish. Yeah. 
Yeah, fish are asking for it. Like, look no, at <laughs> I feel bad because MMM is my favorite emo. But um, no, I just like sushi. I don't even like fish. Like, I do not like salmon. I like cod. I like lobster. I like crab, and I like sushi. But like tuna only. I, just I don't, don't really like salmon. Understand. I don't like raw salmon. I don't like cooked salmon. Is it an ethical thing? Like no, Adrian, well, right. I started becoming vegetarian when I was 10 because I was on Okay, left to un all vegans Listen, why? and vegetarians. Listen, why? Listen, why? All right, sorry. I was left unsupervised with my computer, and I stumbled across PETAKids.com. And then that, it was Mr. just Girl's like... Girl's website? No, it was PETA Kids, oh. and there was very graphic, like, computer games or chickens and blood. Wait a second. And Is Adri... Mm -hmm. Are you one of the girls that I would go on to Zerka's show sometimes and he would like scream at you that you're too emotional and then kick you off the show? Yeah. It was me. And I never <laughs> cried on Zerka's show ever. That was oh actually my God, the that was only so person awkward. he did that to. <laughs> yes. Holy shit, I just remembered that. Oh my God. I remember it was me, you. And scream at her this week. John and uh, <laughs> Kiana. It was me, you, John, and Kiana one day. And we were all just like, talking for a really long time. And then out of and nowhere, you were just like, Adrian, I think you're just really emotional. And like, yeah, you just are too like fucking Matt, stupid. I said something like, that like struck his nerves. Oh, like you were trying to, he, was, he thought you were trying to cancel him or something. He got like super mega fucking, yeah, stupid. Yeah, I remember He said that. something about like, relation, open relationships. He said something about relationships. And then I was like, bruh. Maybe I, because like listen. you're insecure or something. And then he was like, what the hell? And then he kicked me off and called me emotional. No, besides Steven, there's no one who the open relationship thing, it works for them. Who knows if it Besides works for me? Steven. Listen, dude, my life is in chaos constantly. That's, that's why Steven doesn't promote it. He says it's complicated. True. How do you remember that, Steven? I did call her emotional for no reason. Like... <laughs> I don't know, something just brought it up. Oh, I think it's because you keep cutting her off and I'm trying to think of what that reminded me of. And I remember it a long time ago, we were on a show together and you were like out of no, I remember you, it was like out of nowhere too. And it was like super savage. I was yeah. like, Jesus. Like, I started well, to feel awkward. She talks slow, though. Does she? Sorry. Yeah. Just tell us how you really feel. Just say it. Say what you really want to say about her. Um, She's the only real friend I've had on Twitch. She picked me up at the airport, gave me a place to stay, didn't try and make out with me, didn't do any weird shit. Do you want to see something funny, Steven? I'm going to send you a video. Why do you guys, why do you guys just interrupt each other all the time? The both of you do it. It's just so fucking annoying. You guys are so rude. <laughs> no, it's okay, but it's just like, Jesus. But okay, yeah, send away. John was in the middle of an emotional moment there. Yeah. yeah. See? It's just because we're like twin. Uh-huh. Okay. That's twin. Yeah. Is she like, is she like the only girl that um has like respected your boundaries like that, John? Um, yeah, because I'm not saying girls do that to uh -huh. me. I'm saying, have you noticed how different girls act if you sleep over at their house? They start to like walk around their room and uh -huh. they kind of like try and, hey, are you going to bed early? And, and they think like something has to happen. I don't yeah, know. Does why. that happen a lot? Yeah. And I've noticed like, I know I'm charming and all that, but it's like, I'm very straightforward. So. Uh -huh. You'll know you'll know if I like you. You don't have to like ask weird questions and shit. You know what I mean? Hmm. And yeah, no, Bullet never did anything. She's cool. Well, oh, really? Because that's kind of what exactly what you were talking about. Well, she was. You're staying over so at a girl's house and like she's walking around and like I'm just saying no, it, it almost sounded exactly like you were exactly just like I don't think you could give a more accurate description of that than what you just said. Oh, you guys hate Bullet. <laughs> Look at Why the clip. You, you guys hate Bullet? No, she's who great? hates Bullet? I'm just saying it was kind of weird that you were like this. blowing her the fuck out like that. Well, I'm talking about Adria I met first. So. What is this? Hold on. Friends. Friends? Unfortunately, Ooh. the internet is only I made this filled so long ago. with enemies. You're Are you a YouTuber? Yes. What is this clip? With enemies. Watch it. <laughs> Why? Why? Okay. Wait. I mean, oh, God. Sorry, God. Uh -huh. No, you first. I was about to totally pivot. I was going to ask if any of you guys had played Among Us. <laughs> Did you, were um, you guys in yeah. on that? I didn't really like it. How could you not like Among Us? It stressed me out. Yeah, that's kind of the fucking point of the game. It ruined my friendship with Train. Oh. Like, <laughs> Did it really? I, I swear to God, I've always had his back, but after one game of Among Us that got too much, I went live, 
I went live and said I'd knock out that dead corpse looking motherfucker if he if it was in Twitch rules and stuff and I really really hated him and he never he never ever used it against me he he apologized for, for something he didn't even do he's like Zerka my bad and that's the first time I had a homie because basically I was so unfair to him and he was the greatest friend I've ever had because if if someone goes live and says you're a dead corpse looking motherfucking <laughs> loser i called him everything you could call fake blah 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 and even my chatters who didn't like tra train there's like a couple even they said i was being really unfair <laughs> Wait, you then, got that bad over amogus yeah and it was the lobby with xuc actually and I, then i had a war with xuc and xuc actually literally dm'd me because he didn't want the war with me because his chatter started liking me when I started memeing them hard, him and his mods. Uh -huh. And he DM'd me and he said, Zerka, your IRLs are good. You should stick to them. But he was really saying, don't play Among Us with us, with, with us anymore. Wow. Right? And that's why that game is haunting to me, like when I hear it. Jesus. Yeah. How dramatic. Yeah, yeah. And that's the first time I ever snaked the homie like train. Like, I, I, I yeah, I didn't, that's the only bad moment in my life on Twitch. Okay. Yeah, and we never talked about it. He just pretended that he was in the wrong when really I was in the wrong. He's a real one, you know. Yeah, something mature about that guy. He, he that guy grew up fast. And then he gave me a hundred thousand dollars. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, does that influence your feelings about him at all? <laughs> yeah, yeah, can't do no wrong now. <laughs> hey, listen, dude. <laughs> no but it was mind-blowing when the slicker stuff happened because i messaged train and i was sending him fifty thousand crypto as in like look slicker hijacked you take the stuff you gave me and then give it back and he said no i don't want it wow. he's like don't worry about it so that guy's <laughs> have you seen that bro all you've done is scrap 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 go farm, <laughs> go farm. Dude, what? that conversation <laughs> was i'm still haven't processed that conversation <laughs> like they were so adamant like they were both talking to me and they were like yeah like the last part of the call is really important like we have to leave. and i thought i thought at the end it was going to be like this is where like miss and Meyer are going down like this is going to be like the serious shit because they were so adamant yeah. about leaving this and then it's just like it's just like a fucking anti-mitch fucking 20 minutes of shit i'm like what the or fuck am i listening a, to bro i'm just scrap scrap scrap, scrap. go build something go farm no one's giving you scrap your stupid fucking youtube video Do you, you know what no one no one knows oh the behind God. the scenes of that guy but when I found out Slicker scammed him and I told him, mm -hmm. I said, here's 50,000 crypto I'm transferring you. And because I know you got scammed by Slicker and Slicker is my team. And I felt bad. And he never corrected and said, no, John, he owes me 100,000, not 50. And I would never be like, yo, Trey, I'm not giving you 100 bands. 50, I'll give that because, you know, you've gifted a lot. Uh -huh. And he never told me how much Slicker actually scammed him. He could have easily said... Oh, it's actually a hundred, but he kept it a secret from even me. And that's when I was like, wow, this guy is actually like a good dude. You know? Wow. It's wild, Steven, man. is it weird that I had like a fantasy of, okay, I want to get a Photoshopper to Photoshop Slicker scamming me out of 40,000 and give the receipts to XUC and Ludwig. And, but this is the devil brain talking. I didn't actually do it, but that was, that would have been the easiest Let way. Let me hold a dollar. Because if Slicker said that's not true, who would believe him? So I could have easily taken him. <laughs> true. You, you know what I mean? That could have been the easiest robbery of my life. But you probably have to prove something, right? With Photoshop, it's so easy. No, there's got to be, like, they've got to have a better way to do that. I would hope. No, because then I'd say, are you not tr are you not believing the victim, John Zerka? No, they've got to have a better way to do that. I can't believe it. I'm pretty sure if I really put my head to it and got the Discord boys in there. Question. Yeah. Remember when Destiny said he would give 10k each to train and XQC for providing evidence? Oh, <gasps> I won that fucking bet. Fuck those guys. He did guys. win. What? Destiny had won that. He, they didn't take it. They provided evidence. No, no, no. But they didn't take the bet. That's the bet. No, no, no. The bet was. These two guys are so conspiratorial. They were like, the narratives are against us and nothing we do can flip it. And I said, if you release actual evidence that actually shows you're in the right, 
the narrative will change. You guys are way too conspiratorial. I'm like, no, there's no way. And I was like, try it. And they did it, and the narrative oh, did change. that was the bet. Yes. That I was knew the they bet. were in the right, so I knew it would be best if Destiny covered it, but they didn't want it. It was weird. They're like, it's drama. Because, dude, the worst was XQC. He just messed that. He made it a mess. Like, yeah. Know. Like, there was a time where Gasson gaslit him for, like, an hour, and everyone turned on XQC. And then train saved his ass. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, I remember. By the way, when it comes to high roading, Hassan's a black belt. That guy is... <laughs> wow. Yeah. There's something in the male brain that feels cringe high roading. So a lot of us avoid it. Like, No, no. We high road, but not obvious high roading. Hassan doesn't have that piece in his brain. He can high road... He can look his uncle in the eye and say, you never helped me. <laughs> yeah, probably, dude. His uncle in the eye? Yeah, I'm telling you, that's he, there's something missing in his brain. And if he does give people their flowers, it's very short-lived. He goes, yeah, I mean, my uncle helped with some things like tech. And it's what never does uncle just, do? His uncle <laughs> gave him his life. What the fuck? Really? We're, Adri, he never went viral. He started off in an office, YouTube office room that his uncle owned. Ah, uh, he did okay on Facebook. But it wasn't his platform. No, but I'm just saying. I first met him when I went on um, Queen of the Hill from the Raj the, show. The first time I met Hassan? I met Hassan before I met you. Adri, Ooh. the first time, is that true? Out. But he doesn't remember, like, we didn't actually have a conversation. It was just I was competing for Queen of the Hill, and he was the only person who defended me, Aww. surprisingly. No, and, he remembers um, you now because of your viewer account. Damn. You know, the first day I met Hassan, they're, like, egging me on to get his commie ass. And the first, it was with Invader V, and she said she cheated on her boyfriend who had very bad mental health. <laughs> and the first thing Hassan Piker said, the first thing, because I said that's disgusting, the first thing that came out of his mouth was, why, was he not pleasing you sexually? I was like, wow, so it he has that built-in narrative that the girl can never do anything wrong. Wow. You know, that's why they call him Frat Boy Piker, you know? That, no, that wouldn't make sense, actually. I guess that's why they call him SJW Piker. I don't know. I'll show you. This clip. No, AJ, I don't want to see that. Like, look at all those people in that <laughs> clip are banned. <laughs> the Lakers They're all canceled. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, man, hold on. Let's see. Blast from the past. Here we go. Gross score slick. Where are you That's from again? Talking. Who's that? What do you mean, yes? Oh, Mo what in the top right. Isn't he a League of Legends dude? Yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yes. Oh, Yasuo. Oh, fuck. Wait, no, Yasuo's name is Mo, right? No, his name's Mo. Oh, yes. Oh my god, dude. The, the first time I met Yasuo, he walked up to me at a TwitchCon party and he's like, I banged her before you, bro. I'm like, who? The first time you met Yasuo? Wait, what? Yeah, he's so funny. He came up to me and he's just like, uh, that girl you're with, uh, she was with me first. And I'm like, I'm not with her. What the fuck? And yeah, like I got, what's that called? Mogged by him. Like he chatted me. Did he really? He's a great guy. He literally hopped on my stream when I was at a hundred viewers. Like, that's a good dude. I and so did got... Destiny and Train. I wish I got good at League of Legends. No, you don't. A Adri, your, your mic is low. I'm sorry, I'm like leaning back. I'll, I'll sit up. My bad, John. Did you drink enough agua today, Adri? Yeah, I've been drinking water. Mm. I, do have a little, I have a headache. Yeah. What about you? Oh yeah, since uh, Vosh taught me how important it is to stay hydrated, so now I'm I'm drinking. She doesn't understand any of these jokes. Why do you keep making? It? <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't know. I do this thing where I talk to everyone, not just her. Okay. Yeah. So you like make jokes at her, but it's really for the audience, and she's just no. But to sit I, I there. like talking to chat. No, the joke is about Vosh. Yeah, I know, but she doesn't know who Vosh is. Yeah, that's the funny part. <laughs> okay. Based. Do you know the Vosh lore? No. Someone asked me no, about your Vosh. hair being blue. 
I don't know what that's about. Okay. Don't dye your hair blue. It won't come out. Okay. I dyed half my hair blue once and it didn't come out. Like it was stuck. I mean, unless you want to stay, you can. As long Destiny as you, you can dye it brown, it will cover up. Destiny, okay, people are mad on... at me now. Yes, dye your hair blue. Do it, do Destiny, it, do it. Destiny's going on Joe Rogan this year. Is that true? Yeah, we'll see. Someday, maybe. Before Claw? I was lying. Oh, I'll never beat Claw, no. Claw definitely beat me there. How are you going to compete with God? True. Actually, God. <laughs> he said yesterday. Oh, you think... you're doing it for charity. Okay. Yeah. Destiny, you said blue. yesterday, you, what do you think? God can't say the N-word? <laughs> <laughs> Bro. <laughs> I watched it four times, man. <laughs> Claw. I don't know, dude. Not even God can, I guess. Can God create a word so powerful not even he can say it? <laughs> no, Desi, the greatest post you ever made was the invincible meme. Oh, man, dude. I've made a lot of memes, okay? I probably stole it from someone, to be fair. but Why do people want me to say Obama? It's they want you to say Obama. Now. It's like a chat meme. They'll jerk off to it later. Don't do it. They're fucking perverts. Okay. No, they're trying to make you say Michael Obama. What? <laughs> yeah, I am sweating right now. That emo of <laughs> Steven sweating. That's me right now. Everyone <clears throat> wants me to say it. They're saying please. What do you mean by that? Say it. Steven. Yeah. Say Obama. You know, you know what really grinds my gears about you? Yeah, tell me. I don't want to open a can of worms, but oh my god, are you intentionally obtuse when it comes to the 9-11 topic? Like, <sighs> okay. We were I'm still waiting for you to unpack that. You promised us, and mm -hmm. I wanna see you uh I wanna see you fail miserably. Okay. We'll work on it at some point, okay? You promised us, so you have to unpack it. Mm-hmm. If you run from that, I mean, you're going to... Let's go to Building 7, Steven. Uh-huh. Okay. What is Building 7? World Trade Center Building 7? The one that uh, fell hours after the other two did? Yeah, is not that office fires? Yeah, I think so, right? Yeah, that's interesting. Is it, though? I mean, it would break a world book record, right? <clears throat> Yeah, kind of like how demolishing all of those things would also break every single World Book record for all three buildings. That's the one that didn't get hit by a plane, right? Uh huh. The one that uh, no explosive sounds came out of before it fell, that one. The one that debris from the other ones hit it and maybe started an office fire that took down the first building from an office fire? Yeah, the building that was hit by a plane for the first time in the entire history of the planet. No, no, no plane. Nope. Oh, there was no plane. Well, it's building seven, right? The third one. Well, you were talking about the other building that fell. One of the right. The debris, the debris of that uh -huh. hit building seven. That's how the office fire started, right? Uh, maybe. I don't know. I'm sure there's a lot of things starting fires. <laughs> yeah, that's interesting. Like, just completely fell into itself with no plane hitting it. Uh huh. Is that interesting? That's, a, that's an intense fire, right? Must be. Hmm. Adriana, do you think 9-11 uh, was an inside job? Was it done by box cutters? I don't know. I was literally one. Yikes. Oh you don't have to make it weird, dude. Are you actually going to debate that? Uh, no. As soon as I did my research for it, Nick got scared. Didn't want to anymore. <laughs> so. There's no way Nick backed out. Yeah, I, of course I'll he never did. I'll never believe that. It's like one of the, from what I saw from that one documentary, it's probably one of the worst conspiracy theories. Apparently there's like a more credible thing where it did happen as people saw it happen, but it was like planned by Jewish people. And I guess that's like what the more extreme. What, what was Nick's take? I don't even know, dude. I don't think he's actually even, I don't think he's even aware of what the conspiracy theory is. Hmm. So we're not getting that stream? Uh, apparently not. Oh my God, I got bit by a spider. One in the chat oh if you gosh. want to see Destiny debate Nick Fuentes on you know you 9-11. Well, because I have like it's a like... fucking spider bite started on my hand and I didn't see or feel oh. or hear anything. So he literally bit me and then bounced what like a fucking loser. 
I would see a mosquito flying around in my room. There's no way there's a mosquito in my fucking apartment. I don't understand why spiders do this. Imagine being on something as big as a human being. Like you're playing Shadow of the Colossus in real life and you're like, I'm just gonna bite it and see what happens. No, that makes sense. How does it make oh, sense? It's the dumbest thing in the world. No, I mean, it makes sense because I randomly get bug bites and I haven't seen a mosquito in my house. Oh, you're telling the but truth. I see spiders. What the hell? <laughs> there was like the spider emo and saying it was. Wait, me. he acted like it never happened? Huh? Oh. Oh, so Destiny didn't back out? Destiny did. Oh. No, I didn't back out. I did all my research. And then Nick was like, oh, I wasn't agreeing to debate that. I was like, okay. <clears throat> That's so strange. That's like the easiest dub of his life. Yeah, is it? It's it would, a mosquito, bro. I'm on like an eighth floor apartment right now. There's, I don't even think mosquitoes fly up here. And my, all my windows your... are closed and everything. What? So your take is Mohammed Atta and his buddies did it with box cutters? Yep. <laughs> Why? What's your take? How did it happen? Mm, I don't know. Oh, okay. At least you're honest. Yeah. Yeah? Yes. Who is Larry Silverstein? Um, is that the guy that owned World Trade Center Building 7? Mm. Yeah, he had a dermatologist appointment, right? Oh, that's crazy. How many other hundreds of people weren't in the World Trade Centers when they got hit because they had appointments? Yeah, seems like all the all the higher-ups. Yeah, really? Right. All the higher-ups? You don't think anybody important died? Careful. I don't think any ruling class elite died, no. Is Larry Silverstein a ruling class elite? Is a billionaire a ruling class? Um, I don't know, is he? I'm asking you, are, is having billions of dollars, does that put you in the ruling class? Um, I don't know, I'm trying to see what this guy does for... Is he still alive? Oof. Who do you think tipped him off? Alliburton? <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> Even <laughs> which debate against Nick do you believe you won? All of them. All of them? Adrian, what's so funny? <laughs> what about, so, do you remember the scuffed so podcast? Funny. One? What about the scuffed <laughs> podcast debate years ago? Did you I win lost that? that one because I had Hassan weighing me down. It's different. It doesn't count. How do you lose a podcast? That's kind of true. Are you? Why don't you share us or clue us in on what's going on, Adrian? <laughs> what's the thing? Oh, I'm sorry. I just... This better be better than my eleven. <laughs> I swear to God. I mean, not, not there's just so many right? dogs. I put I put a dog in your chat and then everyone just spams it. It's just so adorable. You're actually like four years old, Adrian. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm tired. <laughs> yeah, they found a passport in the rubble. Yeah, they found a lot of stuff in the rubble. Except airplane chairs. What do you think happened, John? Well, I mean what was the uh what was the outcome wasn't it uh middle east middle east yeah why don't you tell us what do you think happened i mean war in afghanistan iraq oh you're not gonna etc. answer are you too scared to answer or well i mean it's clearly inside job yeah by who how tell us about it oh, the ruling class billionaires and i know you're trying so hard to go to the zionist thing but like really going anywhere the, <sighs> the, the, Je the jesuit order is who's in control of the world like, make no mistake about that. Okay. Well, next time we'll debate this for real, okay? I need to... Uh... He's going to bed. Yeah, you were fucking... No, I wouldn't much. debate you, Steve. He's anyone, off the melatonin. Anyone who, who has that take on Building 7, you clearly won. Like, you're being good faith. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I love you guys. Um, it's been fun. 
We'll hang out. What? More. It's only 10 p.m. What the hell? No, it's it's one o'clock for me, dude. Fuck. Yeah. He well, stay 20 more minutes. He's off the melatonin. Yeah, dude. You can choose the last topic, Stephen. Go ahead. Uh, no, I have shit I need to do. So I love you. No, he needs to sleep. 20 yeah. more minutes. Love you, bestie. Yeah, I love you too, buddy. Be careful. Fuck, I feel hey, guilty bye. now. I have to go. I don't want to stream. Stephen, just keep streaming. Go stream. You stream, okay. John. No, no, I want to hang out with you guys. I, might play I want Fortnite 20 more. Bit. I want 20 more minutes. No, I have to go. Play. Anyone from DGG want to play Fortnite with me? Please hit me up. Okay, bye. <laughs> <laughs> She's about to get 4 million DMs from Virgin Fortnite players. Because <laughs> I helped her out. Good night, Jesus guys. Jesus Christ. Okay, good night, buddy. Peace out. Yeah, Steven. What? It was an inside joke.